Okay, we should be live. Hello, everybody. Um, Dead eyes, are you there? Okay, you're you you're low on power. Uh, let's cut one of our chill musics to get to the other real quick. Uh, so, um, yes, uh, this isn't Born of Bread, uh, th this, th th this is, what? uh, this is Bellatro right now. Uh, I was playing a round of it before the stream started, and I was gonna stop as soon as the stream timer came up, but I have, I, I have a good chance. I'm trying, I'm trying. There are li literally, like, T two jokers left and like one of them's a one of them's a legendary joker it doesn't matter this one this motherfucker it, it need to get a ton of a ton of chips in one round and also the th this voucher th this th i have only one voucher that's locked still i need to reach anti 12 and that's impossible because anti 11 is broken but i i have uh, my build my build has a high chance there is a very high chance this will actually work so we're going to try <laughs> You're fiending is what the problem is. I'm what? You're fiending. You've got an addiction. No. Uh, <laughs> okay, let's see. Throw up. Uh, I sick. am low on power today. I was kind of having a generalized lethargy. I don't know why. And uh, on top of that, having to like actually do work at work oh how dare they i know right like normally you get like two to three productive hours a day at work and the rest is either like meetings or just scooping off on your own time uh, it's more like five productive hours today Oof. and then it could have it could have been even more uh if they had actually given me the information i needed which is is it going to be a list of users that this dashboard's going to look at I have no way of obtaining that on my own, so I have to wait for yeah. other people to respond. I win, but that wasn't the game. The game hasn't started. The game has only just started. <laughs> okay, reorganize my things because they moved them around. I don't like that they did that. And it's one of those but... things where I was supposed to look at like six dashboards. The last one, I ended up having to create three copies of dashboards that were within that because it was a dashboard to report on usage of other dashboards. Yeah. And then... Uh, yeah, and it's, it's like all gotta get done before the end of the month. So I was doing sort of all of that this week. Get the ancillary stuff next week. So we'll have to see tomorrow if I can get answers to my questions. If I can, we'll all be golden. Golden Freddy? Hello, Freddy. <laughs> uh, that was a very good video. Okay, death is pretty good, and just use temperance to up my money. Not that money matters, but uh, screw it. We'll see if we can succeed. So you started the stream, and I was making a stromboli. Ah, yes. By which I mean, I was heating up a stromboli in the microwave. Nice. If I had, uh, finish my work on time. I would have made chicken fajitas. But I guess I'll just do that tomorrow. And, uh, hello to everyone out there in video land. Yeah, hello! I'm also not that worried, because I don't tend to get that many people on Wednesday. I just know Shark Boy Owen is here, hello. And also 20 Chris Moore, who contributed to the potion stock. Oh. Do not insult them like that. These are the blessed people who have shown up on Wednesday. They have. I have so graciously popped in to say hello, to see a bit of the bread, which you're not doing. I feel like you're really letting them down. Yeah. I don't know. Bellatro's more popular. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, maybe you've got some people lurking who came in 
Yeah. The co granted, it's not like anyone will know I'm playing Bellatro. I still have it listed as Born of Bread, which we will get to. Just, I, I need to see if this run succeeds. Ah, uh, there's the smiley face again. The smiley face could help, but I think the Cadavanish is going to be better. Cavendish. Yeah, this banana, it's called Cavendish. Or, yeah, Cavendish. It's uh, absurdly useful. Okay. Oh, I need to touch something. On my phone. Okay. It's about 400 times as much. Wait, what was the talk about that? Okay, I think it's off. I think last time I saw that you maybe still had like a uh, content warning on the stream. Yeah, that was from the uh, uh, that was from the Slay the, Sp the Princess run. Yeah, that one needed a content warning. It did. Huh. Although, presumably, it'll be uploaded on your YouTube. Yeah. The VOD channel. What does VOD stand for? Video on demand. Um, let's go, Palmer. Thank you for the resub. Uh... Oh, you're still all squishy. I'm not, I'm not that squishy, like. Yeah, no, it's distracting. Okay. Uh, I had this earlier. Do I want this back at the cost? I mean, unless you want to be a cartoon character. I mean, I. Have you seen these elf ears? Yeah, like, but Palmer's right. I could be squishier. I gotta remember which one, uh, I think it was this one. Okay, so, uh... Oh, well, maybe it, not. <laughs> no, the green potion's the Durgan, which, uh... I, I think my thing hadn't reset properly, which uh, you have probably now reset it properly. Rar. Uh, okay. Screw it. But you turn into a red dragon. I do. Why are we gambling? Uh, because I'm very close to winning. And if I win, then we be done. Spoken like a gambler. He has a problem now. Call the National Gambling Help Hotline. You know, he thinks he's on a run. It's not how probabilities work. This is not Born of Bread, this is Bellatro. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm playing Bellatro very quickly just to finish this run because I was in the middle of it and it's going very good. Look at the fire. The fire says I'm very good. Remote control the claw games? What? What's the point then? If you need to virtually do a claw game, uh, just play the Yakuza games. They always have a claw game. And honestly, it gives you better odds than a real claw game. I mean, can you not just buy the things in the claw machine? You have to, like, win it first <laughs> before shipping it to you? Actually, no, that actually is useful for what I'm doing. Yeah, no, take you. <laughs> oh, this is... Oh, this no, is you can't. Well, that's fucked up. Get 
standard I'm free mega pack. I don't need to bother. Currently eating dinner. You say your main didn't get banned, and yet you're not using your main. Curious. Almost like he's the uh, impostor among us. Sure. Okay. just up my cards because whatever. Yeah, Japan's relationship with gambling is strange. Because they allow it, technically. I mean, kind of, but also no. No, yeah, exactly. Like, technically gambling is outlawed, but then they have pachinko, which isn't gambling, totally. Are you clicking off the screen because it's going black on the screen? Uh, yes, when I click off the screen briefly, it will go black. You do need to look. Well, I clicked that just to see what they got, what the thing uh, Sinclair posted. In the first second of that, having a chuckle in it. Okay. So I'm still regularly her. getting this all in one hand, which is pretty good, but the wall is going to hit me. We're going to see if we can climb it. if you'd gain 100 pounds eating Japanese food, because they have smaller portions. Yeah. And it tends to be healthier. Yeah, uh, to, uh, to explain what, what he mean, yeah, gotcha games. It's, it's gambling, but it's, it's, there's no legal requirements to prevent it. So, uh... Yeah, well, there should be. There should be. Um, but it turns out pretty much uh, most governments have actually gotten, like, corrupt up the wazoo and have atrophied their ability to pass legislation. No, you don't say. Uh, yeah, it's very sad. Uh, too bad we don't have any of those, uh, you know, girl-addicted gotcha maniacs here right now. To demonstrate. <laughs> yeah, it's a shame that neither of them showed up. I mean, I know why. One of them is working, and the other is fighting Lawrence in Bloodborne. Uh, I don't take that second one as an excuse. <laughs> uh, it's not. It's an explanation. Uh, fine. Oh no, playing a two-pair resets my money. Not like that matters. <laughs> Uh, but you've got to have money. Okay, so we didn't do this in one hand. We'll have to do it in two. Oh no.
Also, your palacho is still coming through your microphone. Yeah, because I I didn't put my headphones in originally when I started this, and Bellatro doesn't uh, notice when you change that stuff. It's fucked up. Yeah. Trying to do an Alex there. What is it that you need, Palmer? Oh, what is that? Uh, yeah, the, that's a screenshot thing. It's a... Hmm. Oh, there we go. I don't know what vibration stars means. Baby, how about a magic trick? Pencil in the I'm eye. gonna make this. I'm gonna make this pencil disappear. <laughs> it's it's gone. I I realized is how honestly not far off the Heath uh, the Heath Ledger Joker is from just Ben Shapiro. Mm. <laughs> well, I don't see how that could be true. Okay, here we go. If it were true, that would mean he's more on the side of chaos than order. Take all those. See how well we do here. Okay. I say to the criminals of Gotham City, if you don't like the Batman, just sell your businesses and move. Okay? Someone else will come in and buy them. Okay, but, uh, what if old Benny boy just happened to uh, loosen his, uh, his little hat thing? Weren't so restrictive on his brain? <laughs> Supposedly he's fighting with Candace Owens, but I haven't really looked into that yet. Uh, hey, Sinclair. Hello, Sinclair. Oh no, not the red potion. We were doing the green potion. <laughs> Sinclair just did. This is why you must label your potions. <clears throat> In fact, that potion creating game you're thinking about better have a system for letting you label your own potions. Uh oh, you gotta get one. Oh yeah, I'll have made this. The problem's gonna be in the next ones, which uh, are gonna be harder. See, you think Bellatra's quick, but you've been going for 20 minutes. This is true. I have been going for 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. 
But I'm also at the point where, like, given how close this was... Oh, god damn it. Yeah, no. Mm. Mm. Okay. What can I get rid of to justify this sucker? Is there, wait, you have 16 enhanced cards in your deck? Yeah, I have 53. There's literally only one card in my entire deck that's not enhanced. Ah. Uh, <laughs> that's funny. Uh, I see. Because Splash works really well with this with Scary Face. Wizard of Legend. No, I have not. I'm not even sure what that is. <laughs> no, see, Minecraft, that's the thing. He's a fiend. It's not going to be the whole stream, he says. It did. He just, he's licking the baggie, you know? He's got, he's got to get the last little bits. Yeah. Literally, I'm only doing this one run. The fact that this run is going forever is an irrelevant detail. Yeah, it's not about length of time. Uh, see, the thing is, right, he's either going to win it or lose it on this round, and I think that'll be it. Oh yeah, it is pretty much. Like, either I win this blind, or I lose this blind. make that cinnamon crumb cake but when I have time okay. I know right I try to guilt everyone into coming on the Wednesday stream, and then he pulls this. <laughs> I mean, we're doing good. You know? It's the Circus of Value! The Circus of Value! First hand is drawn face down. Miss Bioshock say? one. You can always go back and play Bioshock one. You could play it on the Switch even. I think they put it on pretty much everything. Not after that four hundred dollar bill. 
They don't make a four hundred dollar bill. Badum tish. Want being sponsored by Nintendo? Oh dear. I was gonna tell everyone about the lovely upcoming games of uh, Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door and Luigi's Mansion 2 HD. You know, everyone would have liked if they had uh, taken the Luigi's Mansion port that they did on the 3DS and then HD that onto the Switch, but no, Luigi's Mansion 2. Don't have like a dark, spooky, oppressive game. Have the, uh, the theme park version of that. Yeah. Well, that's what Nintendo is more confident, uh, comfortable selling. There we go. We made it to Anti Twelve. What's your unlocked? Uh, yep, I unlocked the final voucher. So that's. I need a hundred million though. Uh, I need to keep going. Ah, see. Uh, which again. Isn't gonna go much longer. The wall is going to kill me. Uh... My soul is mainly on LOZ, however, since there's nothing new about the game, I'm mainly staying on X thread. Legend of Zelda? What, what do you mean? The, the, there's plenty of Legend of Zora. Okay. Score at least 300 million. So if you beat this, have you done everything? Uh, everything but the challenges, but uh, like that's a whole other thing, and I don't need to put that on stream. Okay. No, you know they're going to announce uh, Wind Waker on the Switch and Twilight Princess on the Switch any day now. They're going to bundle them even. They're never going to do that. Yeah. But hey, if you can't wait for another Breath of the Wild, you could always play, like, I don't know, Power World? Personally, I say it's never been a greater time to go back and play those old games that you missed or used to love or whatever. Okay. I think the gaming industry is falling apart. Yeah. Because it's a tech industry and they're all falling apart. I don't think you're going to make this. Yeah. I don't know what, like, special condition you need to hit for it to do, like, a hundred thousand per hand. 
I has only like six million. Mm. Well, you got the one thing. I did, so this is at least a partial success. And again, I was just doing this to waste time before the stream started because I had nothing else to do for like 30 minutes. Right, but give it your best. Which is a uh, flush? Is there a flush no. here? Yeah, there's a flush here. Okay. Okay, here we go. All the way to like. I mean, hey, you didn't even need to hit the small blind. You just need to get over 100,000. Yeah. So, you know. Oh. Uh, Still, new high score. High score. So I'll have to look, at, look up how to uh, yeah, unlock to anti-12. Maybe I this thing will help you. Cave paintings, goddammit. Uh, it lowers your anti and discard per round. Okay, that's interesting. Hmm. Okay. Now that our uh, now that our uh, opening in uh, preview video that is unrelated to everything else is over, um... oh, I need, I need to remember how to do voices again. Oh, hide the thing. Mm -hmm. Hey, wait. What? Oh, yeah. I was literally just doing that. Uh, I mean, I don't know if it was just the opening round. It was uh, quite far in. I don't know what you're talking about. It was the opening round. Uh, okay. Well, hey, supplies, Bellatro stream means uh, we're not going to do a whole separate stream for Bellatro. Unless y'all really liked that and want to see me, like, really hammer out that last thing I have to get. They don't, and they don't. <laughs> Are you speaking for chat, guys? I am. Yeah, okay, maybe you like Bellatro, but it's not that interesting to watch. Tell that to all the streamers streaming it. I will. Where are they? It's me it's behind the school. <laughs> Fight them. Fucking grass. Okay, yeah. Um, game? You failed to load this room. Cool. The basement's actually loaded in the same space. That's interesting. Uh, yeah, we got the new person. Uh, it, 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 it's a detective lady. She, she likes being a detective. Her family doesn't take her seriously. Also, can you uh, pop this up on my Oh, yes. Is it popped up? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, see, that's the thing, is uh need to have everyone here if we were going to do Bellatro. Yeah. And uh, Alex doesn't show up early because he's working, and Vincent doesn't show up because Alex is What it seems to be happening lately. Well, again, he is busy in the minds of another one of his hyperfixations. Ah, uh, you know, I can't throw too many stones. But hey, I didn't miss a stream even when I was hyperfixating. Yeah. 
hate slash interested feeling with her. Yeah, that's uh, complicated. An expedite and crew lock supplies here. Professor Mustard. Oh, but. Isn't he, like, from Clue? No, you're thinking of Colonel Mustard. Uh, <laughs> Professor Plum. Yes. Professor Plum, played by the great uh, Christopher Lloyd. He's not just Doc Brown. Yeah. I need to rewatch that movie sometime. I'm right, I've got the Blu ray. Oh, yes, your broken combination. Yeah! AoE plus AoE. It wins Great. the game. See, Inagi here. What was his name? Yagi. Iyagi? Just Yagi. Yagi. This is Yagami. Whip them good. Four, twenty-four. Why did it say twenty-four? Sixteen, twenty-two. Level up. Lump. Watch this. Oh, boons are maxed out. Yep. It's the cool edge. You know, from Sonic Unleashed. Cool what? Cool edge. What? Is the um is the Arctic level. Oh, is that the name of it? Yeah. Because they're not... Uh, levels themselves are not named after the fake countries. They're named after... I guess sort of the theme of them. It's like Spagonia's is Rooftop Run. Uh... What was it? Apatos is Windmill Isle. Adabad is Jungle Joy Run. Redborn. God dang it. We are the bread of the yeast. Made men by the yeast. Undone by the yeast. Sinclair, Our Sinclair, crust yet to open. Sinclair really likes their food themed uh, the yeast. things. Okay, let me guess. It's a race. Yeah. Hey, little heroes, I hope you've been doing your whatever. I prefer mental gymnastics to real ones. Dude, he is high. Good screw early to run. Never did me no harm. Although exercising is addicting. Nothing beats the endorphin rush after a good workout. I tried to do that today. It did not kick in for me. <laughs> Chips are also addicting. I exercise right on my right to be skeptical. I'm not that addicted to chips, really. True. No pain, no gain, right? Oh, no. I draw the line at running around aimlessly. Besides, where would we run to? Well, not just physical, anyways. You gotta run, uh, use your head to find the best route to the farmlands and the holy highlands. You can best the time I set running on my hands and feet. Want to know the rules? Now we're pros. Is she doing, like, the, like, horror, like, bent over backwards on her hands and feet, like, scuttling towards you, run? Maybe. Making that exerted face. <laughs> the Holy Highlands, Humble Heights. Where in the Humble Heights is this? Oh, yeah. Her.
He got food. Fuck puh. Also, bring the chat. The tomato is early girl. She's a hero. I guess. He's classified a hero by the guild, but... Yeah. Who knows? But the heroes do seem to mostly uh, just do their own thing. Like, it's more like a, like a prestige popularity contest than any actual hero work. Yeah, one's into exercising, one's into snowboarding, one's a thief. Uh, one's a big bully, and one's the moon. Not really. She channels the moon. Supposedly. She can do a race. That's a race through checkpoints. Always good when you're racing towards the camera. <laughs> yeah. Careful, weapons hurt. Okay, up by the bugs. <laughs> Again, racing towards the camera. Ah, oh, no! Oh well. I just will let it go for the red potion now. See, Sinclair, that was my point. Is why, why, if the potions match the color of the form. I understand you'd uh, quickly overlap with colors. Or... Yeah. But hey, if you want to see a new form, make sure you put in your points towards the community challenge. It's under the points menu. How do you get? Back. You must be able to just sort of. Hmm. Yes, we don't know what the next form is, but I'm gonna bully him to make it a monkey. <laughs> so we'll see if he uh, falls for it. I mean, the monkey was going to be the 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 one after the next one. Oh no. We'll have to rearrange those. <laughs> oh, I crushed it. Yeah. Oh no. Okay. <sighs> That's not do that again. Ever. Honestly, that one was a lot easier than the other one I had to do. <laughs> Yeah, well, there's less of the flying things you had to hit. Yeah. Uh, well done, little heroes. That was an awesome time. But you ain't feeling cold anymore. And eh, here's your prize. Do you already have running shoes? Yeah, I think it increased my running shoes. Yeah. I run even fast. Even Is faster now. Is that the now. secret? You, you just sort of layer running shoes? Yeah. I suppose the problem is you have to keep getting bigger and bigger shoes. So you're like wearing the shoe that's the size of that one meme that's been going around. Yeah. I mean, by that logic, that means that like clowns are actually super fast. Yeah. Hey, knuckleheads, I'm back. Io! Oh, I, I remember. It's like you took a beating too. 
Was it that dumb doughboy again? What happened? I told you to stay out of trouble! Uh, I tricked little Torp into breaking a curse and giving me the Sunstone Shard before I... Huh? What? Really? Come on, show me! Uh, I must have dropped it. What do you mean you dropped it? It's not here. It's gone. It must have fallen from my pocket when I fled. You lost it? Hey. Not cool, boss. Leave her alone, Jester. It was an accident. Just in case you dumb brains forgot, we need all the pieces for the plan to work. That bumbling doe doofus probably has its flowery mitts all over it. I'll have to steal the shard all over again. Jester. You can't push Io around. Look, we're not even sure this plan's gonna work. But it definitely won't if we don't stick together. It, of course it's going to work. We're bringing back the Empire! That's why we're doing this, right? We all want to go home. Not really, eh? It wasn't that great. Yeah, I mean, they kind of treated us like garbage back there. At least here people are nice. We're doing this for you, Jester. It's not like most of us had all that much worth going back to. No family, no home. So? It's not like you've got any of that here either. Jester. Ah, oh, that was harsh. <laughs> Quit all this whining, you're just finding excuses! I do this all myself, I don't care! I'll get that shot back on my own! He lays around here doing nothing as usual. Bunch of slackers. So, sit next or Alfie? Wait, Jester! Um... Mr. J! I can't believe those guys taking Lowe's side. She had one job, and it was deciding how her name was pronounced. Well, it can't be an L, it has to be a capital I. It is a capital I. other names. It is a capital I. I'm just, I don't know how to say IO uh, or EO, so I just say Lowe. Um, that or Jester's bad at reading. He's, he's, a, he's a little ding nut. You, I heard what people used to whisper, calling me useless. Saying I can't take anything seriously. That I brought shame upon my father. That I didn't deserve to be his son. When I'm taking it seriously this time, I'll prove them all that I can be a good prince. A good leader. By telling my subordinates to shut the fuck up. The most important <laughs> mission in history of the Empire and father entrusted it to me. I swear I won't let you down, Dad. Ah, that was horrible. <laughs> so heartfelt, so dramatic, so pathetic. How many ways can you say daddy issues? You, how? How did I find my way into your little rat's nest, worm? Please, I'm an expert hunter, and you're not exactly difficult to track. Besides, all that moody shouting and monologuing echoes around down here. Who are you? Why are you following me? What do you want? Me? I'm a hero. The best hero around. And you're a nasty little villain with a bounty on his head. If, you, if it's money you want, I've got loads. I'm a prince. So I heard. A prince so weak and worthless, not even his own father wants him. Sounds like you have nothing to bargain with, your highness. Besides, what kind of hero would I be if I took bribes? No. Try st to struggle a bit. I like a good fight. Anyways, running away. Bye-bye. Yeah! <laughs> Uh-oh.
Thank you, game. Uh, I don't like that. I don't either. The real villain is Robbie Rotten. Warning, boiler pressure rising. Automatic lockdown engaged. Further pipe damage will lead to catastrophic explosions. Have a sewer day. Beep boop. I'm back here, little worm. Catastrophic explosion imminent. The Royal Town Sewer Company would like to remind its workers that unionizing is strictly forbidden. Uh, Have a sewer day! Beep boop. Fuck you. You stubborn wretch. This isn't over. I'll be out there, just waiting for the perfect moment to strike. And I never miss my mark. Uh, that was too close. No time. I need to do something now. Uh, we're controlling Jester because uh, in Paper Mario, between chapters, you'd control Bowser and or Peach. He is Bowser and or Peach. There you are. You wouldn't be you have many cups of tea we go through waiting for you youngsters. Hi, right, Joe. We've made quite the discovery. Indeed, we've been investigating a very interesting mystery. Did you say mystery? This, this is Chloe. She's very excited. As she should be. Nothing gets the blood pumping like good questions of science. I say, it would be easier to just show you. You must come to the Aca Academic Guild right away. Uh, I was looking forward to some hot baked goods. I was looking forward to being warm again. We can't disobey wise elders. And there's mysteries. Fresh mysteries are better than pastries. We'll head to the bakery afterwards. I bet Mr. Baker will be so pleased that we finally got a sunstone shard. He'll probably make us something extra special. Okay, the game is just sending us right here. More time. Pay attention now. We have a great deal to discuss. Now, without further ado, we've developed the rest of the pictures from our camera. Developed? Please, no vacation slideshows. We still have not. Ah, I'll skip the first few slides. We examined the ruins in the undergrowth. And the story they tell is incredible. Oh, but first. So. We live here in Guru. Right where we're burned. There was an ancient civilization that spanned this entire area. Perhaps even the entire world. I think he had to... Oh. They had unparalleled technology, far beyond anything we have today. Using the incredible power of the Sunstone, they did impossible things. We found flying machines made of stone, far too heavy to fly. The carvings speak of controlling the ocean, the weather. They built great palaces and temples, building the size of cities. And that's a hard work, a ruling family. The rain lasted centuries, building higher, spreading further. Until one day, it just stopped. The entire civilization collapsed overnight. Some powers have been completely erased from history. The ruins in the undergrowth are all that remains. And we have absolutely no idea why. So Jester and his friends, they're from this ancient civilization? Precisely so. Perhaps even from the Ember family itself. 
And Jester wants to use the power of the Sunstone to bring it all back. Indubitably. And that means if Jester were to successfully rebuild the ruined city beneath our feet... What would happen to our dear royal, little royal town? To this very guild office? Two buildings can't exist in the same space. Exactly. Love, They'd be the unbearably cramped. I love the stank face on Goat Boy. Look at him. Yeah. Look at him, look at him stank face on us. He is being stank faced. I love that. The most cramped. Unthinkable. Unshit. My head hurts. Please tell me this is something I need to go fight someone. All in due time, young buck. We need to prepare a few things before our next expedition. <laughs> Yay, that means it's pastry time! What? That is a really good fucking pose and expression there. Mm-hmm. Feel like Ocarina of Time vibes. Uh, also, we can introduce Chloe to Mr. Baker and tell him about the Sunstone and stuff. Okay. Gerudo run. Three. I'm good, I'm good. Don't worry about me. Vibin. Vibin, how's Lawrence? Oh no, I, I beat that fucker a while ago. Yay! Beat that fucker last night. Good for you. Yeah, no, it's, it was terrible and I barely even realized I'd done it. Like, <laughs> I was just slashing away until I saw, like, oh, prey slaughtered, oh, the health bar's gone, oh, I did it. The the cor fuck. the bloody the bloody chunklet corpse I've been dealing with has stopped moving. I guess it's dead now. It is pretty much how you have to get into it. Like, he fucking sucks. He has more HP than God. Anyway, so I beat him. I beat Lady Maria, and then I went into co-op and helped two other people beat Lady Maria. <laughs> I also love how you just didn't even bother mentioning the living failures. Oh, I, I mean, I actually had beaten them before, but yeah, I like, obviously one try because it's the living failures. I know. It's just... Like, you can't... It's, they're funny to mention. They are. I mean, I think they have one of the most killer themes for such a fucking throwaway boss fight. Mm. Anyway, so, uh... Yeah, you know, I'm, I've not done my due diligence, I haven't checked any VODs or done anything, so could y'all do me the great uh, favor of filling me in on what the fuck has happened in this story? No. <laughs> uh, well, I okay. mean, I would have wanted you to, but... Okay. So, uh... Um, and... I'll let Jesse do it. Yeah, so, uh... I'm trying to remember which, uh, you haven't even caught either of the previous two VODs, right? No. Okay, so... Uh, I know uh, nothing about nothing. I so, mean, you told me there was, like, an Ikea mansion. Yes, which... I can actually just show that real quick. Yeah, so we got two new party members, because we have Lint, obviously, still. We got Yagi, yeah. and we got yeah, Chloe wait. here. So where'd you get the other two? Uh, Chloe we got from the Ikea mansion. Because oh. it's where her family lives. She's oh, just... she's a little detective lady, um, but her family yeah, doesn't yeah. take her seriously. Because and they're why not? they're too busy being um, uh, fucking snobby rich people who live in an IKEA mansion. Ah, oh, you know I see what you're saying. Yeah. See this place now? Yeah, it's. Uh... It's also yeah. haunted. It's a haunted Ikea mansion. Yeah. Well, you know, we all deal with our problems. Hmm. It's kind of like... 
don't know if anyone played Far Cry New Dawn, but that's supposed to be post-apocalyptic, but like they also had a vaguely kind of IKEA thing. <laughs> Was Far Cry New Dawn the one where after, it's set in like the timeline where the nuclear apocalypse happened, but everything's in neon for some fucking reason? Uh, yes. Like everything's pink and neon. Yeah, because, you know, games industry has phases and trends. That was the uh, magenta phase. Yeah. Or pink. And it was also the phase of. Uh, Giving all the enemies, like, levels and health bars and resistances. And, uh, okay. that's what you want in your first-person shooter. Yeah. Is yeah. your guns to not just kill people. Oh, don't you know? Doom Eternal's one of the greatest games I've ever made. Uh... No, don't you know? We need to be Borderlands. God, that was when Borderlands was very popular, if I recall. Borderlands is never very popular, it's we, actually all We need to be Borderlands, because actually what we're trying to be is Destiny. But God, everything wanted to be Destiny, even though Destiny wasn't very good. Anyway, uh, so before you two get any further sidetracked, uh, mind telling me where the goat boy came from? Oh yeah, so uh, in the second chapter, um, we uh, had to go up to... The Holy Highlands, uh, this giant monastery in the hills with llamas. Um, and we had to go there to do a tournament arc, because there was a tournament arc happening, you see. Uh, Actually. Yeah, we got up there, and uh, he's like a Naruto. He joined us to be part of the tournament arc. Good for him. We even had, he even has a Sasuke character who, whom we've beaten the shit out of like twice. Hell yeah. Yeah, he's a little baby. Anyways, so here's what, Palmer's favorite character. Oh, uh, I see, I see. Little leaf. No, no one, one comes visit me. me. Are you doing it? Oh, you can do it, yeah. Yeah, there. Leaf stand on mountain. Yell invites, but no one yell back. Think maybe they not here, so leaf go to town and yell there. But they shut doors and windows on me. Uh, okay. That's just depressing. There's the sucker. <coughs> yeah. Anyways, yeah, her ability, she has this little light thing. It's mostly just a throw for flames. And, mm -hmm. uh, Yagi here can meditate. And uh, oh. certain things will uh, phase into reality when he is meditating. Yeah, he is uh, certainly Next. a man of many weird traits. Yeah. Except the uh, astral plane. Now, has anything happened in regards to... So, so, like, why in the plot were you doing any of the things you were doing, including even now? Like, what, uh, how does this relate to the... The fire empire or whatever. Oh, we uh, it's a quest to collect the MacGuffin, the Sunstone shards. Right, right. The uh, the prize for the winning the tournament arc was a crown that had a Sunstone shard in it. Ah, I see, I see. And uh, then the uh, family at the IKEA mansion had and had the Sunstone shard as a family heirloom. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, he's he's doing juices. Making just amazing faces. <laughs> yes, Palmer, you can marry Leaf. Anyways, uh, Ghost? Oh man, this sucks so bad. What's wrong, Mr. Name's Ted, and like, I'm majorly bummed out here. Mm. Used to love coming here for a spot of a skinny dipping, but for some reason nothing, like, feels the same anymore, you know? You mean it doesn't feel the same as when you had skin? What are you talking about? I'm just a regular dude from Royaltown. Yeah. When you had skin. What a weird thing to say. 
Okay. So, uh, can we help you with something? I hope so. I am dying to take a dip in the river, but something stop it, stopped it flowing. Had a little peek, but a fiery dude with serious anger issues chased me away. Also, tripped over and blacked out or something, because I woke up here and the monster was gone. Yeah, blacked out. That's probably it. If you can encourage that stressed dude to chill, I'll be in your debt, peeps. That enraged pot belly flare uh, flares just up ahead. Be careful, though. He's got a nasty temper. Some boy's all corpsed up. He doesn't realize that. Uh, damn, damn, damn. Not even a corpse. He's just a ghost. I uh, saw all this. Was displeased that her kind gift had been abused. She sought out the descendant of the old chief. She found him still sitting on, on a blackened throne, still weathered in purple flames, surveying his cold, dark empire. In a voice as searing as the heart of fire, she spoke to him. I gave you this gift of light and warmth so that you might keep the people safe and prosper. Instead, you've used it to create coldness and misery. You sit here in darkness before you, as I once sat in the light looking out on a just unjust world. Are you not moved? But the Emperor did not, apply, did not reply. He had long since ceased to listen to the words of anyone. He believed the power of the stone was his and his alone. I see that the ancient Sun Empire was uh, up to a lot of good things. Sad Vocaloid song. Well, they're all sad in their own way. <laughs> Refuse to elaborate. Anyway, uh. So, yeah, so what's happened vis a vis the whole, like, Heroes Association thing? Um. Oh yeah, so the oh, uh, jerks. Yeah, well, not all of them. Just you know, uh, X B Y X Y. So uh, uh, after the media quest, we're like, okay, we it, we had to like go get assigned the quest to actually hunt down Jester. But mm. uh, the uh, initial. Uh, the uh, the number one was like, no, that quest is mine, and uh, she's like, I don't want to share. Um, and she's like, fine, if you go win the tournament, because the tournament, as far as she was aware, was like unrelated, I'll let you, I'll let you team up with me. Um, which she obviously never intended to, and she just ran off to go do the quest while you were doing that. In the meantime, yeah. Uh, but we went and did that, and then we came back and. Uh, we were like, okay, can we team up with the quest? And he's like, she already left to did do that thing. And, he's like, and they're like, oh. And then for the, um, the playable jester sections, uh, uh, for like the last two chapters have been them and, uh, jester in the sewer, and then number one shows up chasing him. Rage. Look at this guy's just dead as shit. Listen, I need to level with you. You realize that you're a great guy. A great guy. I agree. What is with Yaki's fucking faces? They're all good. Oh, that's just that's just his gimmick. He just makes faces. They are all good. All of them. <laughs> Anyway, I'll say this much. Character design-wise, I'm liking Chloe. Yeah. Look, 
what a what a hefty being raw might. What is with the video games and little blue detectives? I don't know. Ooh. I can now carry more items. Ray. Also, Vincent. Yeah, how are, how are all the Colored songs sad? Uh, they're not necessarily. Guys just likes to you know, hear himself talk. No, no, see, that's me trolling by saying sad isn't pathetic. Honestly, I feel like my joke answer was more flattering to you. <laughs> Children and grandchildren of the first embers were not content with being keepers of the sunstone. They quickly hungered for power, claimed the sunstone offered themselves. Oh, I do themselves too. Its sole and rightful owner. Raised armies to push ever outwards and enslaved their enemies to build ever higher. As their hearts charred and blackened, their flames became tight, uh, uh, tinged first with red, then violet, and last a deep purple. The purple corruption spread through everything that they had built, seeping into the air, the soil, the water. The light darkened, and the warmth died, and the Ember Cities became dark, cold, hard places. Okay. Wait, but they are purple. They didn't used to be, is the idea. Well, but purple's better than other colors. Does yeah. that mean they're corrupted? Like, I don't... I don't mean to be, like, color racist, but, like, purple's just kind of the best one. Hmm. I'm just saying, you know? Focus. I mean, Focus. considering purple is my secondary color, or my persona, uh, yeah. yeah. You got that? You, you got that understanding of purple? Be oh, I'm Yagi, Yagi. <laughs> yeah, powerful move. <laughs> got it, boss. I'm training. I've manifested within the ground. Oh no. See, at first I meditate to bring things onto this plane, and I meditate to remove things from this plane. You were getting your shit pushed in. <laughs> yeah. See, that, that's that weird thing where, on one hand, I have my dominant strategy where I win in one turn. On the other hand, if I don't do that, uh, I get my shit pushed in. It'll happen. Let's get a little black eye bun. No! You bruised the bread! How are we going to consume it now? Bruise the bread. I hate eating bread that's been marred by imperfection. Okay, you know what? This is the first time I've not liked Yagi. I don't like that pose. Why not? Bad. Fucking hell. <laughs> anyway, also, how's, uh, how, how's the paw? Is he still in prison? Uh, oh no, oh. after... He was, uh, proven innocent by a, like, I don't know, simplistic the, tree spirit? The, yeah, the, the tree spirit we fought at the oh, end of part one. I know, I, right, no, yeah, I remember that. Yeah. yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. yeah he like, gave us a little, uh, uh, like, note, say, uh... Yeah, and then that was enough to, yeah. Clear him of innocence, Yeah. yeah. That guy was great. We should have put him in the party.
Yeah, uh, well, that's not what they're going for. It'd probably be better than the, the little fanfic box. Ooh. Nah. That's not good. Good. Like you like the naivete? You can't have these treacherous life forms fighting alongside your pure bread being. Yeah. And yeah, this was the second area of the game, the humble height of the uh, holy highlands. There was that mountain that we had to climb for the monastery. Yeah. So do you have a specific goal as of now, or are we just kind of fun? Uh, oh yeah, I, it's get, we need to actually go back to uh, 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 Papa Baker and uh, like say hi and update him on the plot. Yeah, well, so like we were, like you were just doing, but instead of doing it in the game at the same time, you're doing it for me first. Yeah. Like you know the the standard uh, uh, Professor Goom shit from Thousand Year Door. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, because we this, shouldn't it, this only do comparisons Mario. to Paper Mario. I mean, it basically is a Paper Mario, though. We can do comparisons to uh, Bug Fables. Uh, this game doesn't seem as brutal. Yeah. It's definitely not. Besides, there's a uh, there, there, there's no fucking vi, and that's just sad, you know. Yeah, all you get is Chloe. Yeah. yeah. No one here it has enough raw gremlin energy to be vi, like except for maybe Jessica. Mm -hmm. was the best part of that game. Like vi was so cool as like a protagonist, as someone who genuinely like isn't. Like a good person at all, but like is still like neat. I love yeah. when when stories can do that. Money, please. Oh no. Uh. <laughs> We're back, Mr. Baker. I have a new ingredient. Can I help you cook can I this? Help you? Oh yeah, go. Can I help you cook this one, Mr. Loaf's dad? I have so many ideas. Hello. I I think that Jester guy got here before us. Ransom note. What? No. Oh. Vincent? Oh, yeah, yeah, right, right, I forgot. <clears throat> I have your dumb baker guy. Bring my sunstone shard to the sewers and maybe I'll return him. Jester. P.S. Uh, you suck. That cheat no good low life. It'll, it'll be okay, Loaf. We're, we're here to help, right, guys? Yeah, we'll fight him together. Really? Of course. We'll get to the bottom of this. Oh, steamed loaf. I'll give Jester the hiding of his life. Okay. Uh, after we get Mr. Baker back. I'm with Lynn. It's time we taught Jester a lesson in honor. Where are these sewers? Logic suggests they're probably below us. Somewhere. Maybe downtown? Alright. Then we just need to find uh, the way in. To find all the way in. Yeah, I like that correctly. Yeah, no, I like that. You gotta have the commitment yeah. to the as-written dialogue. Yeah, also, uh, I guess it's worth mentioning in terms of it. Uh, the, uh... The tournament ended with us winning the tournament, but they just sold, uh, they were able to successfully steal the thing anyways. So, uh, no, but so we that's act why it's like we want our shard, like, because you only have one right now. Yeah, because we did successfully get the shard from the IKEA house, but that's so yeah. far been the only one we've successfully gotten. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, I don't know. At the end of the day. This doesn't even seem like it should be a conflict, necessarily. <laughs> oh god, Piper's not having the time, huh? Well, 
<laughs> like, why you just give the guy the shards and then we can build the empire back up and then we can all have a good time in the empire. We, we just went over why the empire was a piece of shit. Yeah, but it doesn't matter because, like, come on, you saw the inciting incident. Fucking, not like this place is great either. Is it because uh, all empires are pieces of shit? Oh. Yeah, including the kingdom that we've got here. They they have a they have a train system. Also, what are you? Uh, I I, 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 don't, uh, I yeah. Uh, see, but there's a difference between an empire and a kingdom. Yeah, one of them is hearts, and the other is, uh, not. And the other is age, of. Uh... Yeah, you're right. Oh, hey, it's the fox again. I was supposed to do laundry today, but oh well. I'll just change my sheets instead. Oh, it's a modern coffee house look. Yeah, I love uh, the coffee scoop. Yeah, you know what it is? It, it's all getting back to straight lines. All getting back to straight? Right. Yeah, well, get, get not if of... I can help it. Hell yeah. Fight the good fight. I just meant like you know furniture and architectural wise. Yeah, but like you know, it's fun. Shaped like a donut, fuck you. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Stop posting notices about Among Us. All I hear is. Oh no, I was going for Sans on her tail. I know. Yeah, but like, you know, Woody Woodpecker's good too. Didn't we have this exact same thing before? <laughs> the Woody Woodpecker Sans yeah. Undertale thing. Yeah, it's Nan's Undertale. It's basically the same, like, sound. Nah, supper level. <laughs> Hello, What's new up? human. Uh, do you also like to eat human food and speak of inane subjects? Yeah. Ooh, I like this orc. Indeed, yeah. indeed, the weather, it conspires, does it not? The orb in the sky that watches us, we shall not speak, we shall speak not of the lights that pass overhead at night. Of course not. Do you enjoy money? I too enjoy money. Small trinkets of metal and paper. Oh, how we love to watch them dance. So, very cultural. Yep. Tomorrow, will it occur? Will it be as today was? Our primitive human minds cannot know. We cannot perceive time in multiple directions. How laughably underdeveloped we are. <laughs> we have so much in common, all of us humans. Yep. Okay. It's just a random, random alien. Okay. Humans, is that what we're going with? I guess that's one of those things where it's like, yeah, well, humanity is probably just 
basic concept that's not actually locked into species. Yeah. Well, anything can call itself human if it calls itself human, you know? Ooh, yes. Entomological uh, determinism. Yeah. Like, po points to the frickin' uh, humans in Yarnum. Yeah. Or the fucking. I don't remember what. I, th I think it. Was it like One Punch Man? That was the one with the, uh. Like the underground people who called themselves like the true humans, or the true earthlings. There's some shit like that, so it's like. Yeah, that, that checks out. Maybe, I don't remember. Uh, Slash. Yeah. God, his ass. Do you like how you're still getting live streamed all the time? Yeah. Are we not? Yeah, let's do it. We've got a live stream in the live stream, so we can live stream when we live stream. Oh, also, uh, I, I noted how I did some co-op to kill Lady Maria a couple more times. Yeah. I at, at first tried to do co-op to help people kill Mikolash, and that just was not going well. <laughs> I'm just... It turns out there's never amount, any amount of, like, good you can be at him. There's no point if you can just get instant killed. Like, like yeah. having more players for the Mikolash fight kind of just doesn't change it. <laughs> it doesn't change the dynamic even a little bit. It's still yeah. just like, hey, so here's this guy. Chase, and, chase uh, him until he decides uh, to instant kill you. Yeah, until he decides to instant kill you. And then if you happen to... Uh, you hit that fucking coin flip on being instant killed, well then you're done. If not, then keep going until the coin flip uh, fucks you. Like, it really is that bad. Hmm. Like, no shit, there was, uh, one of the times, uh, got him into the second arena, I dropped down on him, but I dropped down on him as he launches the attack, and I fall inside of it? And I'm, again, rendered dead quicker than I could have even perceived with my eyes. Oh, shit. Oh, we made it to them. We got the guy. The oh, that's great. snowboats showed up. Oh. Old Snivelly here has been complaining for hours. I was just about to give up and dunk him in the big stink. Huh. You must be Chester. Who else would I be, snow brains? Ah, we've caught you red-handed. Hand over, Mr. Baker, quick sharp, and don't try any funny business. Give me the sunstone shard, and then you can have it. Come on, it's five on one. But you, you won't try anything, not when I have your it. precious papa. Now hand over my gem! Just come and take it, Jester. Get him up already! What the? Ah! Ah, mm. a great job, Dobrain! This never would have happened if you'd just given me the shard that you were supposed to. Now I'm trapped! You broke the floor. 
You dodged my attack! <laughs> oh, he's got you there. The tennis rubble has an ember design. Those boss beliefs. That column. I know this place. We're inside the palace. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Don't move a muscle, flower breath. Hey, play Hades. Huh? <laughs> you got lucky. Now that thing's rocked off of me already! <sighs> yeah, there was a soldier from the army my dad and his council were building. Pretty impressive, huh? I bet you don't know a lot of people who can raise the dead. You know someone who can raise the bread? Ah, uh, thank you. I was gonna say it, and I, I just like now someone else has it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, they found a useless magic recipe. It was supposed to make bread talk and walk around or something. What? Really? It could have worked right, but who'd want that anyway? Touch the nerve, dough face. Because my dad's really clever. He modified the spell to raise the dead instead of bread. Much more useful than doughy dolts. Although, I can't believe these soldiers are still here. Scared? Me? No way. I just never saw the soldiers up close before. They're weirder looking than I thought. It surprised me, that's all. Anyway, we need to get out of here. Uh, which way was it? I didn't come into Father's council rooms much, okay? But I did ever treat me like a little kid. Father said I was in the way. No one ever listened to my ideas anyway. Let's look around. There has to be a way back up. Yep. What? Perfect. Here we are. True companions. Last second. Okay. I don't think it counts as a plot as a like playable companion. I remember this alcove. This is where Alfie and I hid. There used to be a gold statue here. We used to spy on suspected spies. At least, till we tried to expose this one general as a mole. No doubt he just looked a bit shady. Dad was so mad he put us in the dungeons for a week. Why am I telling you all this? It's none of your business! I need to get out of here. Whoa, wait, this was mine. There's barely anything left. Sid, Io, Clyde, Alfie, and me. We started our own council after I got laughed out of Father's war chambers. Sid said that it didn't matter if I couldn't hold a sword. They're just for brutes anyway. And Io said if I knew magic, uh, I'd never need a sword, so she taught me sorcery instead. And Kyan gave me a bunch of weights to toughen me up. Ugh, whatever. I know where I am now, so let's get out of here. Also, you know, he was talking about raising the unbred, and I was just having the thousand yard stare. As you should. Don't look into the future. Loaf! Loaf, my boy! Can you hear me? Loaf, we're lowering a rope. If you're not dead, climb up. Oh, I'm trying to get food so I don't pause. Yeah, if you're not dead, really, Lint? Last up! Ha! Looks like your dumb friends and I check it out! See you never, loser! Chester? Whoa, Lynn, nice one. Loaf, 
You're okay. He got the hide, Tanning. I was worried. Promise me you'll uh, never fall into a chasm in the sewers ever again. Chasms are abysmal, just the pits. A trip to avoid? He missed Lint giving Jester such a wallop that sparks flew. Pity he got away. It, it was nothing. I. I've never been prouder. Jesus. Um, You're guys, J Jesterum had the Sunstone Shard. No. Jester must have picked your pocket before he climbed up. At least everyone's safe. You can deal with Jester later. We're all I feel better after a nice meal, hmm? I'll go warm up at the bakery ovens. For you, whoever you were, said Italian voice. There you are, Jess. Oh, well, Vincent, you're here. You can do a poor board in verse. Yeah. There you are, Jester. Oh, where are you been, eh? Come on. Come on. We heard a huge explosion, and then we couldn't find you. What happened? Why do you guys care, huh? Come on, Jester. Don't be like that. We're your friends. Of course we care. Okay, well... I'm fine. Besides, I got our shard back. Your aura has gone strange. Have you been? What have you been doing? Give me all that aura shit. Getting our shard back. That's what. I just set a quick trap, kidnapped the baker. You kidnapped his dad? What? I figured I'd just give the pipsqueak a little scare, you know, get him off our tails. So it was all going perfectly to plan, then the floor gave out and I fell into the ruins of the palace. Oh, oh guys, it's all still down there, right below the city. And you guys remember the soldiers my dad was raising from the dead? They're still down there too. What? That's not right. Man, that's messed up. Don't you see? That means the spell will work! We can totally bring everyone back to life! What if everyone's like those zombie dudes, Jester? They're like, seriously freaky. Yo? I don't know. We need to learn more about this dark magic. <laughs> Whatever! I'm going to get the last Sunstone Shard! You can help me or sit here whining all day! I don't care. I'm off. Hey, I'll go talk to him. Maybe there's another way. I'm coming with. This is so messed up. Take care, eh? He's really gonna do it, eh? Come on. Need to find out more about that spell. Ugh. Oh. Alright. Uh, whoa! I can't believe Jester's Palace is still there, right under our feet. Any more comments about his face, Vincent? It's the, again, everyone is good. <laughs> Every single one is perfect. Every basis. Why did they make him the most expressive character? <laughs> well, this is a rather a lot to take in. And did you say undead soldiers? What if Jester brings back more like him? We have to get to the last shard before he does. One more chance to stop this before it starts. Dark magic, ancient recipes, undead soldiers. Why did Papa Baker become Italian suddenly? It begins. Some people said, make him Italian. Okay. My only oh. Barnabas is whisk. I don't like you mixing with this kind of thing at all. Barnabas is dick. But I suppose I can't stop you. Ooh. My old Barnabas is Clark Pup. You got cold stock cocoa from the Frosty Flirts. <laughs> Drifting wildly out of time. Why, yeah. 
You have a gun fur. And hot cocoa is just the thing to warm you up after an icy journey. You're the best, Mr. Baker. Mm. Cold stock hot, hot cocoa. cocoa. Hey. Green green warm like liquid comfort. New special attack. Wow, you made it perfectly. Love, aren't you really going to introduce me to your young lady friend? <laughs> She's a detective. Bowie Coldstock, very pleased to make your acquaintance, Mr. Baker. A fine establishment you've got here. Though I did notice the seal over your door is old and the paint is flaking, which indicates the store was recently reopened. And your apron has frayed er edges, even though royal bakers are required to replace them every six months. So he was just kidnapped. I deduce that although you're a royal baker, you are currently out of favor as the queen is displeased with you. Did I get it right? Yes. Why, that's amazing! All of that in just a few minutes. Yeah, sure. <sighs> Chloe is brilliant. She solves all kinds of clues and mysteries. A little scary. It is nice. Thank you. Tally ho! Uh, Hoist the mainsail! Order the corn to the next place of the sunstone. A very honored car sank into the ocean. You located a single stone in the sea, and that's impressive detective work. Oh, not oh, precisely. No, no, no. Well, that, that, I was that guy too, right? The green one? Yeah, yeah. We haven't located it per se. You see, the legend says the goddess entrusted it to the care of the old gods who dwell in the depths. So we look for places that have ancient sea gods, and cross-reference of places we can get to easily from here. And then we picked a bitch. Uh, a bitch. We picked a yeah. beach that's supposed. <laughs> a real bitch of a beach. <laughs> that's supposed to be a simply delightful to visit. Arto, superb reviews on TripAdvisor. Hell yeah. I've never been to a beach. What's it like? I have the brochure here. Our lagoon is a beautiful sandy cove with an enchanting sunset. I like the sound of this. Where the locals tell fantastic tales of great monsters that lurk in the deep. M monsters? But you thought. But I thought you said gods! Oh, what? Yes! Which are they? Monsters or gods? What's the difference? I'm terribly sorry, we can't help you there. Not our area. The difference is perception. Indeed. That would be theology. That's true. Monsters of gods, I'll fight them all. Ooh. We don't have much to go on. It'll be like looking for a needle in a haystack. A very wet, uh, deep haystack. I say, we can help you locate the piece using our new invention. The Sunstone Underwater Nautical Sensor, or SUNS for short! Just... Sons of the Patriots! <laughs> Just head south and meet us in our lagoon's only village crow's nest. Really, a most excellently close spy location. Part four, oh, yes. our lagoon, a pirate adventure. Oh, wow. No, no. Are you giving him food? Yeah. What, what does it do? Oh. Oh no, not that lad. Expect it the next time you hear a Papa Baker to uh, not be Italian. 
you just have like a random accent every time. Well, you know, I don't get out so much, so the accents are very poor. Ha <laughs> ha! I'm surprised no one's bothering with potions right now. Potion seller. I've been like uh, doing stuff, eating food, making my bed. Yeah. Maybe they don't all have a whole like mm -hmm. stockpile of eighty thousand points. You want? I should do it. Nah, yeah, just... if you want. Oh, yeah. It's hybrid, isn't it? Green. <laughs> Green. Red. I do like the fish in a can. The thing's pretty cool. You should have came here. It's like the guys uh, in Sekiro, the, the, in the pots. Ah, I haven't done Sekiro. You gonna what now? I haven't played Sekiro yet. Oh, that's sad. Well, they're these guys that are in pots. They're like fish. All right, well, I'll do Sekiro kind of next thing for gamer. Yeah, they're funny. Funny little fish, man. Doing Saints Row the Third is just an easy chill out kind of game. You know, I keep hearing about Saints Row, and I've never understood how is it different than than like Grand Theft Auto. Um, where Grand Theft Auto uh, got more serious and then kind of fucking did whatever you want to call with Five. Uh, Saints Row got wackier, like oh, that's good, ridiculously wackier. Like, the first Saints Row was ripping off San Andreas. The second Saints Row was a wackier version of the first Saints Row. Saints Row the third was a, like, really wacky uh, kind of rework of Saints Row to be kind of its own thing. Like, different huh. kind of feeling controls. Mm -hmm. uh, the, and then the fourth Saints Row went so dense and wacky that it basically became, like, Crackdown or Prototype. Oh, yeah. Uh, Part, like, with just absolutely bonkers uh, premises and characters. Yeah, because, uh, pretty well known, the premise of the fourth one is, uh, the main character, the main character is the same for all four of the games. Um, but by the fourth game, he has become president of the United States, uh, and has to fight aliens in the Matrix with superpowers. Good. Someone's gotta finally stick it to him. Yeah. I will deal with all the illegal aliens personally. By which I mean these space invaders. enemies so much easier than the like ice ones. I don't know. I thought you weren't like absolutely dominating the ice ones, but uh yeah. No. Okay, so we've had forest uptown the forest again. Nice yeah. world, and... Camera. What the heck? Oh yeah, and mountain. Yeah, and we're doing beach level, slash ocean. Again, you know, the problem is, like, 
to the beach lends itself to d doing an ocean level. Look out, guys! Charcoal slime on the attack! Uh, don't whack me, please! Huh? You're saying you don't want a piece of this high-kicking warrior action? Not like the, uh, like the Oshers. I don't like, uh, uh shites and debauchering people. Mm -hmm. Huh? You're what now? Anyone understand what he's saying? Sorry, uh, I lost uh, a shoe teeth in a little scushel. Speaking like this, this tricky now. Ouch. Yeah, that's probably my shawl. Uh, you see, I'm a mega shan of the hero Mariam. I went to Cher's Guild to buy a replica of Mariam's hammer. I bought it, but when number one saw me, she shrew me out without my hammer. That she wouldn't show you guys out. Be able to get my model hammer should be back. Sure, we can hammer out a oh, deal. Oh, that, yeah. That's great. Yeah, number one fucking sucks he, ass. He's just giving you the finger guns and pointing, and as soon as you, like, turn around and walk away, he just coughs up a bit of blood. He's just giving you the finger guns and pointing, oh. except, like, the whole time you can see, like, the single tear, like, coming down from behind his glasses. <laughs> yeah. Like, it really hurts. I know that feeling. Like, I do. Oh. I've actually fallen on my face and knocked out teeth before. Oh, damn. It's not, it's not great. and put points towards the challenge. New potions. Monkey, maybe. <laughs> or the other thing. You, re you really want that monkey one. Ah, maybe I can bake them both. Oh. Hey, are you gonna, are you gonna monkey up, uh, Dyes, are you gonna monkey up, uh, on, 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 on stream? Or are you just gonna maintain light bulb? Hmm. It's a good question. We'll have to see. I don't know that uh, it's really like an audience control thing. Uh, well, that's the thing. It's just like you know, is that something you would want to do? I guess. Yeah, definitely. I mean, I don't know. I kind of like the little light bulb because it's like a, it's a neat little thing. It is. It's kind of like I would like a monkey probably more, but it'd be a shame to like have the light bulb just kind of disappear forever. Not that it would necessarily, just that you know it might get forgotten about. But like a year later, and then I remember, and I'm like, ah, oh, bring it back. Yeah, uh, you have to do more bureaucracy to fucking... Yeah. Yep. The permits for one hero here. Yeah. Team of heroes, there is one hero with one or more sidekicks, death six. There's a difference? Uh, that's probably something you guys need to discuss in private. Next. Next. Oh, cool, you guys want to be a hero with a team? No problem, I'll just get you signed up. Just need your signature on this Partners in Crime Fighting Code of Honor. Uh, there, you're all done. Woo! Yeah, just take these to Desk 9, along with your secret identity identification papers to sign the official blood pact. What? <laughs> I'm not sure Loaf has blood. Oh, it's easy. No big deal, really. You just need your hero name, portrait, costume design, and any relevant backstory. And a little blood. Well, the lid can probably do that. Next. Oh. Said nine. Oh, yeah. Want to use your regular names and current outfits? Y yes. 
Why? You can be anyone. Danger Dove. Limitless Loaf. You can have a bazooka and fight the moon. At the very least, you need a good backstory. Eh, I just kind of popped into existence. That's good. Pretty mysterious. What if your mother was a celestial being and you've been sent here to save the world from her greatest mistake? I like that. Write that down. <laughs> I'm just going to take some blood for the signing. They're all done. Welcome to the guild. When you're pending quest shits, head over to just one. You can I told you not to come back. All done. Uh, yes, I say. Unfortunately, the hero number one has already taken the quest you wanted. The, the two heroes can take the same quest. Yes, if the heroes are of similar rank. You're only starting out. Minimal XP, no reputation points, very low recognizability ability score. Not even a logo. Why should I let you compete with number one? Competition keeps things interesting. That's true. Fierce rivalry and backstabbing is the backbone of our organization. Patriots. But mostly, I do want to see you get your asses handed to you. So, uh, fine. Take it. Oh, and your complimentary savers guild welcome gift. Ooh, resolve points. These are worthless. <laughs> well, that's the writer's office in DC Comics. That's the joke. Yeah. Uh, some, some blue person, probably her. Oh, hey, little heroes. Are we battling you next? Whoa, that can't be right. You lot are tiny. Gnarly, dude. I was ready for a rematch. Uh, well, do your best, small fry. Sorry if we get carried away and crush you. I like to keep things loose and go with the flow, but if things get out of your comfort zone, it's cool to tap out, okay? Ah, oh, cool. We do battle ah, with the fight. Oh, they're weak as shite. Yeah! Well, it's almost like this. It easy, I mean. Yeah. Or what, were you supposed to do this earlier, maybe? This was the side quest for much earlier? Possibly. <laughs> hmm. Uh, see, the skier hangs out with the tomato girl, though. Yep, he sure and does. I forget who the bear hangs out with. The bear just exists. Nah, he's usually next to someone in town. Keyblade. <laughs> All right. Well, that was uh, simplicity itself, or whatever. Yep. Huh. Me fire. You're small, but you pack a punch. Mm, nice one, little heroes. You really gave us a tough run there. I think you'll do great things around here. Check you later. Okay. Yeah, that felt like it should have been done a while ago. Yeah. Michael, oh, Jim, and uh, what's the other one? Dwight. Yeah, of course. Yeah, Dwight took him. Get it back. Uh, you know, I didn't realize until just now what the reference was. That it's but... an office reference. Yeah. yeah. Why do people like The Office so much? It's not that funny. Uh, yeah, I've never seen it, so I wouldn't know what to say about it either. Cool. Is that like an actual weapon or? Oh yeah, should be. Yes. 
Oh, yeah. Amazing sword. Three. Yeah, let's see. What about the ice sword I have uh, by comparison? <laughs> it does more and it can hit anyone. So, yeah. Uh, I've definitely a lot earlier. Wait, should you, should you go back in and, like, talk to the hero people again, see if there's, like, an update to this since clearly yeah. you were supposed to maybe do this before? Mm, well, okay, mm, I guess not. You might need to, like, reload the area. <laughs> maybe. I don't know. Anyways, there's a James from the Jesse and James knockoff team. Hell yeah, finally. That happened, by the way. Yep. Who, then who was Meowth? Uh, they didn't have uh, one. No one. Because they were also sort there. of androids. What, 17 and 18? Yeah. Buddy health up. Blue shrimp. Now that I'm thinking about it, I'm realizing that, like, co-op is definitely not the way to go if you want to fight Mikolash. For no other reason than it doubles boss uh, HP for every, like, person you have in a co-op team. Ah. Uh. So, you want him to have as little health as possible so you have as little coin flips as possible for if he just going to kill you. Yeah. Because, yeah, like, the, con the compromise for his bullshit is that he's, uh... Pretty weak. Yeah. Yeah, but like, he still has a boss length health bar, so it still takes a little bit. And uh, that little bit will be stretched out if there's like multiple people in there. Oh, hell yeah, you can pet the squirrel. Yes, what were we doing in the bars? Trying to find that parakeet. God dang it. Whoa. There you I don't like the bee, like, shoots the stinger at you. Are oh, you gonna run out of points?
<laughs> Don't I get to say in this? It's not Alex's here. The oh. thing's literally named Audrey. Yeah. Assumed correctly! <laughs> it's an invigorating experience exploring this uncultured world, but I have no chia seeds in sight out here. Do correctly. Get me the fuck out of here. It's it's a root thing. I'm going to shit. You can hit it with the ladle. I mean, they, if you hit the block, they don't do any damage to you. So. Very uncivilized. From a more awkward conversation that feature, so I'll allow you to return to the castle. Oh, it follows you. I mean, she follows you. The queen. Yeah. Okay, you have to go in the correct direction when you have people. Evidently, yeah, one of the greatest PS3 games is only a dollar ninety-nine on PlayStation Store. Oh, what game uh, do you think it is that this random article is talking about? Inversion. Okay, so the answer is actually uh, Burnout Paradise. But do you? What store is it on? On the the, uh, the fucking PlayStation Store, I guess. Okay, so you presumably you just like play it on your PS5. Yeah. That's gonna be like I'm not. Digging out the PS3 to play Burnout Paradise. That's what they're saying. It's like, oh, it's available for only a buck ninety-nine on the on the PlayStation Store, as of at least like five days ago. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I didn't like Burnout Paradise as much as like Burnout Three. They should do Burnout, another Burnout game. Mm-hmm. I feel like it's the technology has probably caught up to where like that could look really really good. Now it may be too hard to do that, but it'd be nice to see. Oh yeah. Sorry, I just glanced at the news. It's like uh, there's a new abortion ban in Arizona. Yep. Apparently, referencing a law from before Arizona was a state. Yep. I don't know how you can uphold that. The Arizona yep. State Supreme Court is using laws that were not written for the state of Arizona. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but if it, you know, benefits them, then it's fine. It doesn't matter where it comes from. Yeah, but, like, you may as well just say, like, we're just outlawing abortion because, uh, raisins. That is what they're saying. Yeah, I guess it is, isn't it? Yeah. Everyone can see through their completely transparent no, sure. attempt to like, be like, no, it's just based on any sort of law. Yeah, it's no, like, no like, it isn't. You just you make it up the law. Here's the thing, this is a fucking red state here, and, like, I was like, seeing people debate this decision on the news, meaning if the locals here are like, what the fuck is the state Supreme Court doing, then you know they have successfully sent their message. <laughs> like, that this yeah, is getting that's... anyone riled up at all is a sign that, like, clearly they, they know exactly what they're trying to do here. 
Not that it matters. Nobody fucking sane lives out here anyway. Lock porn sites? Yeah. You know, you've talked about that. A porn sites. Yeah. But you know, you can't say it on the, on the Twitch or else it'll kill you. Why not? I, I feel you. like you should be able to say the word porn. Hey, it's this is Sasuke. Mm-hmm. It really is just Sasuke. Uh, I can't say I'm a big fan of the of the Sasuke, but you know, he sure is there, isn't he? Mm-hmm. Well, I'm gonna do a survey. Probably oh, should have just used the uh, bed in the mines or whatever. But you got a lot of items. There. No, you need to be off the forest, not in the forest. You keep saying that, but you haven't explained what it means. That's for me to know, and you to intuit. Please have my own leak to practice with. A practice leak? Do you think I'm a joke? Real leaks are for kujutsu warriors. You can have a small twig. Real leaks are for the leak. Leaks leak. Hey, cat leaks. boy, it looks like your super special training isn't going so hot, huh? You've not even mastered vegetables yet. Mastering a new school takes time, Yagi. Some of us no, don't try to rush the process so we can mess about looking cool and playing <gasps> hero. You do it like this. Like, some of us don't try to rush the process. I do it like that. Okay, I mean, you can take him. <laughs> what, what are you doing here anyway? Did you give up on your saving the world quest yet? No. We're just figuring out our next steps. Yeah, we're following up on leads, shadowing suspects, blowing this whole thing wide open. I really like how it really just seems like you have one partner who has multiple personalities and shape shifts. Yeah. Sounds like a cheap crime paperback to me. You're just jealous I've got friends now. You had friends before! Have you forgotten that I was the only one who would spar with you back home? Difficult to forget when you keep rubbing my face in it. Uh, excuse me, guys. Really sorry to interrupt, but shouldn't we be going? Yeah, you're right, Lin. I'm not wasting any more breath on this guy. Such an ass, Yogi. I've always wanted to be the best warrior I can be, and I used to think... I thought you wanted the sack. I swear. I do want that, but I don't need your help. I'll prove it. Why don't we see if your slow and steady process has done any good? I thought you had somewhere else to be. I can spare a few minutes. Whooping your butt again won't take long. It really won't. You're not very strong. I just gotta be stronger, you know? You kids don't have to fight me just because Yagi's got a chip on his shoulder. You know that, right? Okay then, here goes. Oh, he's got the eye patch. Yeah. Okay. What? Where does he have an eye patch? Because he can. He's the real big boy. Dude, the tournament was like ages ago. Yeah, what? Did they expect you to like stop doing the tournament to like chase after this guy? Oh no, I doubt it. You couldn't even get to some of the areas he was in. Remember, he went to the ice level. Yeah, you did that before this. 
Yeah, but the ice though the ice level was after the tournament. You couldn't have gotten there beforehand. Yeah. Oh, big whoosh. That did some. That did. A, that did a thing. You successfully uh, singed. strong for you guys after all this. But it appears uh, I've been improving so of you. Yeah. Like I was saying, you held up pretty well fighting on your own. And you picked up some killer new moves. He one. used one move on me. In fact, you could even say, uh... uh give yourself time uh, to find the thing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I've got lucky to say as a teacher, but I'm not yet the warrior I could be. Fighting you, at times I was frustrated. I need to clear my mind. I think I'll head to the ocean to find the strength that comes from serenity. Your travels take you that way, I'm sure we'll cross paths on the road to victory. Hey, that's where you're going next, in theory. Yeah. It's been Great. like... Yeah, I was already there. <laughs> Am I not allowed to do side questing? You are. Information. It's almost like you're really together. What, what do you mean almost? Stop doing the soft voice at me. Oh. Mm. Outer heaven. <laughs> Or no, sorry. Chapter 5. Outer Heaven. Chapter 5. The Zadornos just won't fucking stop. <laughs> well, that is how it's going so far. I do love him, though. That's such that, a silly what if, little fella. What if you just fought all the vehicles again? It's, it's funny, because then you get a lot in there. Hangar fills up. But with more people. And I guess better vehicles? Yeah, I mean, hardier. Yeah. So you need to keep upgrading your Carl Gustav. Yep. Do more damage. Hold more rockets. Just like, kind of hate because I was trying everything just to, like get to a feeling of normal today, mm -hmm. and it like still wasn't quite working. I don't know, you ain't got the normalcy. What happened? I don't know. I was very like tired and achy. I don't know, did you have the sickness? I don't think so. Um. It's like very low energy as well, but mm. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. I'm I'm wondering if it was like you know allergies related. Like I tried it taking could be. some allergy medicine. I should maybe try taking another one. Yeah. And then. Oh, you're in gonna... Yeah, this is the vast travel location. I was also gonna try to like clean my room a bit, like 
change the bed sheets and maybe vacuum. Make sure I haven't like dragged in a bunch of whatever. Or if I have, just dig it out. Fill my water. No Fred and Scuff. I'm doing a survey right now. That's why I am. Going into contemplative mode. Fucking tedious. What's the survey on? It's an FGO survey. Ah. Uh. One of those. So you're overthinking it. No, it's one of those things where it's like it just takes a lot. To just be like, all right, select all that apply, select all that apply, fill in a thing here, blah 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 blah. It's fucking like a day long page. this the one? Damn it! <laughs> Was it the one before? Uh, what are you trying to? What were you trying to do? Look at the answer, cat boy. Uh, it was the one after. You need to do one more red. Ah! Oh, you fool! Yeah, the thing was, <laughs> I woke up this morning as having the dreams again. The dreams! Where? No. Where, yeah. um, because it's like sort of the uh, last dream before I wake up in the morning, the uh, feeling of needing to go pee uh, starts influencing oh. everything. Hey, it's, oh. it's family, I think. Yeah. Guys, I fucking know. That is it's horrible when that happens. I hate that shit. I will come back to this after this scene. Mom, Dad, Button! What what happened? Okay, I guess we found the family. I'm my baby daddy! Tell you! We've been looking all over for you! No, we're lovely! No need to shout, Betty. I'm sure Lint can hear us just fine, can't you, son? Only just? How did you end up here? <laughs> hmm? Yes, I would rather like a beer, my boy, but I fret I'll have to wait. See, a big furry, toothy fella put us in here. Can not recall why? It's lovely and warm, so no sense in complaining. Big furry, uh, toothy? Oh, not Palmer's crush. Ah! Uh, What's that? Really? Is, is it him? <laughs> Rude. Leaf, who you? Uh, hi, I am Lint, Mr. Leaf. Uh, these, these are my friends. I didn't spend a misunderstanding. You, you, you seem to have um put my family in a in a snow globe. 
Do you think uh, maybe you could um, let them go? Yeah, and if you don't let them out right now, there'll be trouble. We're not afraid to fight you. Speak for yourself. Fight? Me not want fight. Leaf is lonely. Want stories. <gasps> well, isn't that perfect? What? Seriously? We're not fighting? Oh man, I was looking forward to that. Can't we fight just a little bit? No. No fight. Only stories. Tell a nice story. Become friend. Gah. I don't know any stories. But I bet Lint here does. Right, Lint? Uh, well, I guess. If I tell you a story, will you let my family go free? Tell a nice story. Become friend. Leaf let all go. Hell yeah. Leaf is understanding. Uh, once upon a day... Wait, no, let me start this over. Once was a squid... Dang it. I can't do this. I can't tell a story under so much pressure. You got this, Lint. Just take a deep breath, Lint. We believe in you. You're the best storyteller I know. Uh, okay. I'm assuming it might end with a fight, but... Okay. Here goes. Once upon a time, there was a big bear who lived by a lake, deep within a forest. The bear's teeth were as sharp as needles, and his claws were long, but he didn't want to be feared. Every time he tried to make friends, they ran away from him because of, uh, they judged him too fast. Yeah, we know this story good. We feel character investment. Thank <laughs> God. So one day, the bear had an idea. If new friends couldn't run away, they'd have to get to know him. So the bear went out and found some friendly-looking squirrels in the nearby woods. <coughs> he demanded that they be his friends, but of course they were too afraid. So, they grabbed the, so he grabbed them and carried them back to his home. There he trapped them, safe but imprisoned by magic in uh, his log cabin deep in the forest. They still refused to be his friends. The bear was frustrated. Couldn't they see how lonely he was? The bear calmed down. He then went berserk. No. Clever bear. Think before, act good. Him grow. Character develop. Every day, the bear would sit and talk to the squirrels, sharing stories. Gradually, they got to know him and became less afraid. One day, the squirrel's young son came looking for his family and found the lonely bear, sitting and talking with them. The young squirrel had once been lost and lonely, too, until the day he met the good friends who now accompanied him. The young squirrel talked to the bear and discovered that they had something in common. They both loved to tell stories. So they sat together and told stories long into the night. As the sun rose, the squirrel shared uh, with the bear something that he had discovered, something important. Uh, learn to be happy in yourself. Was he... Was he... happy? The young squirrel's words resonated with the bear. He understood. Stories, like friendships, take two to create. One to tell and one to listen. Oh. He felt remorseful for trapping the squirrel family. The bear freed the family, sad to say goodbye, but glad to know he was doing the right thing. As they left, the young squirrel invited the bear around to the house for dinner, so they began an unusual but enduring friendship. The end. Mm -hmm. That story, beautiful, reminded Leaf of Leaf. What? Me sorry, Leaf Wait. not make people stay anymore. You notice how he spelled his name two different ways there? Did he? Yeah. Uh, seemed like a typo. Oh, quite all right, sir. I'm sure it was all a misunderstanding. Though I can't quite remember what about. Uh, totally unrelated, but Mom and Dad would be okay if Mr. Leaf ca uh, came to visit us on the farm. Of course, dear. Any friend of yours is welcome to visit any time. Yeah, Thank they're you. all with empty hands. We love to visit. Maybe tell you story too. Great, I look forward to it. Glad you're all so safe. 
We couldn't find uh, that. Uh, we couldn't find you at the house, and then. Ah, oh, sweetie, we never stopped looking for you after the Forest of Roots trip. We were so worried. And my friends helped me. We're now on a mission to save the world. Yeah, your son's a great writer, Miss Longtail, and a great friend. <sighs> I always knew you had it in you. Frank, do you have something to say to Lint? Hmm. Yes, uh, it was a um, uh, very moving story, although I can't remember what it was about now. Uh, we're uh, very proud of you, son. And if you want to keep doing this story stuff, uh, then we're behind you. Cool. <laughs> Go share your stories uh, with the world, dear. It needs them. The uninterested oh dad. They really captured the authentic parent experience for, like, most people, I think. Uh... It's, like, not a terrible situation, but not an overwhelmingly great one either. Just yeah. kind of okay. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. Thanks, Dad. That really means a lot. I won't let you down. Okay. Stay with me, Betty. Button. The long tails are heading home. Hopefully. Your friends have learned a valuable lesson. It warms my heart. Is that Jesus? Come to the City of Doors and cross the Golden Bridge. A blessing will be bestowed upon your friend. Mmm. Ooh. Ooh. Well, okay then. I like blessings. Oh, interesting. Does this imply if you fight to Sasasuke enough times that uh, Yagi might get a level up thing? Probably. And I still need to do Chloe's thing as well, which I need to go talk to someone in town, if I recall. Oh, yeah, it's the, the deed to the house or something. Yeah. Oh, right, so the, um, yeah, the way that, like, needing to pee manifests in dreams is, uh, suddenly I'm having to go to a public restroom, like, yeah. <laughs> every five minutes or something. Sometimes it's just one restroom. Uh, like, this morning it was a series of different restrooms. Um, yeah. but, like, they're always like dirty and they're always Ooh. like crowded like it's always people lined up you know waiting yeah. um so that's kind of like <laughs> anxiety inducing in the real world oh, yeah, and yeah. it carries through in the dream as well and, and it, I just hate it because it's it's never like oh I'm in my own house and can just use the bathroom there. It's it's always like no I'm out in public and need to use a public restroom. And everyone's looking at me because there's like 40 people in the restroom. You know, it's, I think yeah that's how like a lot of my like stressful like need to pee dreams used to like manifest. But now it's like gone in a different direction where it's like for me now it's like a lot of like, the dream is always like, I really need to go and pee somewhere, and then something keeps interrupting me. It's always just like, oh, I'm about to go. Ah, no, I have to go do this thing. Okay, now I can finally go to the bathroom. Ah, no, wait, I gotta do that. And oh, no, this person's talking to me. Like, it was a lot of that. Like, I, that's what my, my pee stress dreams are. I wonder if that's, like, the brain both acknowledging, like, it has to go, but also trying to conjure up something to get it so that you, like, don't... Yeah pee the bed. Yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. I, yeah, I'd imagine so. I'm like, if I have stage fright in public restrooms, is it like, it'll keep putting me in there, because then it's like, ah, he has to go, but he can't go, because there's too yeah. many people. Right. Yeah. That's why I always make sure now to, no matter if I feel like I have to or not, I make sure to pee, like, right before bed. Yeah. And I deal with that shit. It's a nightmare. Literally. Oh, you know, it's one of those things where it's like, I only remember 
sort of the last stream before I wake up. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Like the one that tends to get interrupted. Yep. Because that's when you're at your closest to consciousness. So that's actually going to get kind of stored in memory. Yeah. I think the other part was I was actually, like, going down a, a kind of, like, touristy street with Jettle here. Mm. Mm. And then actually it was like, we kept alternating having to go to the bathroom. <laughs> but like, I didn't really didn't follow him off. in. Yeah. Like, I'd wait outside for him and then be like, oh, I have to go. <laughs> the awkward like the, the the bathroom to and fro yeah so. but it, it'd be like you know go into the bathroom pop out like walk past like two shops and then it's like oh there's a bathroom there i gotta go ah oh, super panda you're ruining my potions hi super panda You've just derved up. No, he hasn't. Oh. Oh, you yeah, no, said everything. He, yeah. Yeah, we're not really getting the plot update on Chloe's thing here, but... Uh, yeah. Quick, give us a summary. Uh... Okay, I know where to go. Chloe! Yeah, so that was the guy who, uh... seemed to have stolen the deed to the house. Uh, we, chat we got him down and turned that he did not steal the deed, but he had hired someone to, uh not steal the deed, but also steal the deed. It's a bit convoluted. Um, okay. and it turns out he'd hired the Grey Fox, who is obviously Piper. He's hanging in the coffee shop after this. Who's obviously like... Frank Yeager. Yeah. <laughs> we'll bring a few kids here. Are you, on a... Ninja. Are you on a quest or just here for coffee? We're here to see you, actually, Miss Mr. Piper about an incident involving Coldstock Cottage's title deeds. Sorry, kid, you lost me. Please don't play dumb with me, Mr. Piper. Or should I say... The Grey Fox? <laughs> Shh! You dumb kid. Trying to get us all turned into quest shits? What does that mean? You're probably wondering how I discovered your real identity, aren't you? No. <laughs> Well, first I found the tuft of grey fur you left behind at the crime scene. Still wet, I noticed, so only recently dyed grey. Then Enzo gave us your note with the coffee stain and the mark of the grey fox on it. That told me you wrote it somewhere that sells coffee. The only thing I can't understand is why you stole the title deeds. Blackmail, perhaps? <laughs> What's so funny? Uh, oh, sorry, it's just, that was great. I like you, kid, so I'll let you in a little secret, okay? Sure, I was the Grey Fox, but no longer! I left that life behind to become a hero. All the stuff about title deeds and coffee stains, I have no idea what you're talking about. I found a tuft of your fur dyed grey under the safe. Uh, listen, kid, don't take this personally, but I went years this gray fox up being caught. Nobody could lay a finger on me. So you really think I'd be so amateurish just to leave a tuft of fur on the crime scene? Hmm. Interesting. Besides, I never dyed my fur gray. What a mess that would make. I just wore a gray mask and cowl. So we accidentally confronted who but was the right guy at one point. I was so sure I had it all figured out. Chin up, kid. You figured out something that a few others did, right? My accent. You just got it wrong with this deed thing. Why don't you tell me more about it? I suppose I could. Okay, so... Uh, 
Uh, interesting. Listen, kid, I've been retired for a long while now, but even back then, I never worked for anyone. Never even heard of this Enzo guy, I'm afraid. I'm not your thief. Sounds like you guys have been played. But if it wasn't you, Enzo, or Cyrus, then who took the deeds? Well, it must be someone who knew about the safe, the deeds, and the existence of the Grey Fox. They mm. knew how to get into the safe, and they... I've got it! Come on, everyone. Back to Coldstock Cottage. I need to call in a family meeting. Thank you, Mr. Gr Piper. Your secret's safe with us. Mr. Peter Piper, did you yeah. pick that pack of pickled peppers? He just, like, holds out like just a fistful of peppers. Just every time you run past that one lady, you're like, What for you? But yeah, uh, and, uh... Yeah, uh... Uh, Super Panda. Yeah, I have a whole potion I mean, uh, uh, mixing thing set up. It doesn't do much potion mixing at the moment, but uh, that's what uh, funding to the potion stock does. It adds more so that I can actually do that thing that I said I would do. He was real busy doing a doodle in full color and shading today. Yeah. Well, I had actually already drawn that doodle uh, before I was going to upgrade it to a color, but uh, that, that, took uh, a, that took a lot. Yeah, that was, a, that was a drawing from like a few years ago. Did you do Lint's thing already? Lint's thing? Oh yeah, he got the... he, he unlocked his... Uh... So what they do is uh, see these last moves right here? Uh, that's, that's what gets unlocked. What was Lint's? Mm. Uh, oh. Lens was plot twist. Plot twist! I'm willing to see a storytelling trip broken and the protagonist killed before the climax. Mm -hmm. So it. It's a res. Revives you? Yeah. Oh. Mm -hmm. Interest. Oh, so Loaf can get knocked out and it's not a moment. Yeah. Presumably. Plot twist. You were alive the whole time. <laughs> Elementary, uh, there's nothing Chloe loves more than solving a cold case. Uh, high chance of sleep. Yeah, while well, also hitting all the enemies with ice damage. Not bad. Um, and then Yagi's mind prison! Uh,. I do love the mind prison. Psychic damage, I guess? Yeah. Which is presumably going to be good prison. against some type of, like, more rare enemy or something. Yeah. And this isn't Pokemon. The psychic's not busted. Now he's back into the I Ikea. Back into the Ikea mansion. What's this all about, Chloe? Uh, will your... I'm not doing Cynthia. Will, will your games take longer, dear? Your great great grandfather is waiting for his weekly game of charades. No, not long, Mum. I gathered you all here because I'm ready to reveal who took the title deeds. Hey, why is everyone looking at me? Because, Uncle Cyrus, you are guilty of conspiring to sell Coldstock Cottage. You were in cahoots with the businessman, Enzo. You planned to steal the title deeds and sell the house without my dad's knowledge. Cyrus, is this true? Oh, the grandma. Yeah. I, but... It just makes good business sense to sell it to someone who has a vision of what it could become. But how did you get into my safe, Cyrus? I believe I ah. can. Yeah, let me do the voice, man. I, I believe I can do that. And so did it indirectly. See, I told you it wasn't me. Enough, Cyrus. You still tried to sell the house without consulting the family. You're still to blame. So you are suggesting someone else was involved. Who? This is where the plot thickens. We questioned Enzo. 
He told us that he'd hired someone to steal the deeds and give them to Cyrus to complete the sale. The thief, who was apparently none other than the Grey Fox! Gasp! Yeah. Interest. Interesting! Oh, I've heard of that fellow. And I don't want to brag, but we found him. We found the Grey Fox. That's... That's incredible, Chloe. Did you get the Three. deeds? Sorry, Dad. He didn't have them. Actually, he wasn't involved at all. Someone made it look like he was. Someone in this very room! So I asked myself, who knew about the deeds, had the safe combination, and was a fan of the Grey Fox? And there was only one logical deduction. The person who took the title deeds was... Dub! That bastard. <laughs> huh? Me, me, me? But I've been with you the whole time! Well, where are you now? Uh, I guess outside. Nice try, Glo. But it was, in fact, my own brother. What? My baby? Is this true, young man? Very good, sis. I knew you wouldn't disappoint me. Yeah, I admit it was me. I took the title deed out of the safe and put this whole mystery into motion. But, but, but why, son? Chloe, have you worked that out? Logically, he wanted to highlight Cyrus's nefarious plans in a way that make Dad really take note. Exactly, you bet I did. He's been scheming way away unchecked for too long. But not just that. I wanted to test your detective skills and prove to everyone just how good you are. Ooh. Mom, Dad, you've never really taken Chloe's detective skills seriously. She's so great at it, and you just think she's playing games. When she grows up, she'll be the best detective in the world. Now to... Charlie... I, uh, thanks. Don't mention it, sis. And I have the deeds, Dad. Don't worry. They're safely tucked away in my room. Ew, that's a relief. And you're right about Chloe. We should have taken more notice of what you were up to. I was glad everything worked out in the end. I love a good happy ending. Uh, there's still one small problem, although... Although it pains me to say it, what Cyrus said about the house is true. The business has been slow lately, and Coldstock Cottage costs so much to maintain. I'm afraid we might have to consider selling up. Not so fast, Dad. I may be able to help there, too. In exchange for not turning him over to the police, Enzo agreed to give you some business tips and help get your ventures back on track, Dad. Ah, excellent work, Chloe. For the first time in a while, the future of Coldstock Cottage looks bright. Well done, all of you. Having to move my studio would have been such a pain. Yep. Mm. So you've just learned a valuable lesson. It's good to see that... That, that Naoto Toph's parents are finally taking her seriously. <laughs> Naoto kun. Uh, they really did just decide to include Naoto in this game. Uh, uh, not just Naoto, Naoto Toph. They're fused now. Toph? Yeah, from uh, Avatar, the last bund. Yeah. Oh. Uh, why? Rich Quite family tall. doesn't really give a shit about what they want to do. Rough and tumble. Young girl against the world. But rich family say, I don't like you. Yeah. Hmm. Okay.
Actually, from what I'm aware, Chris can... You, you can get Rebecca to do the, uh, the thing in RE1 if you let Richard die early. Okay, what was that related to? The, so Chris can't mix the potions in, uh, in, R, in RE1 because he can't do basic addition, I guess. Yeah. No, oh, from what, I, I, I've never done it myself, but from what I understand, that is uh, that is the case. Because I always save Richard because I want the shotgun later. Uh, it's a good, the best weapons. Uh, better than the regular shotgun by leaps and bounds. Forgetting when it comes to RE1, I actually got the two speed runs done for that, so I have the infinite launcher and the, the super handgun. Mmm, I wonder. Good plan. You slam guys, is this your model hammer? That's it. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. I'm sure Sean Connery. I probably have no teeth. Sears to find their lost weapons, <laughs> but we do, I guess. to hash, hash one of my Marum battle cards in return. A pretty rare card, but Ooh. I have shit to do for the catch. Thank God. Ooh. Hell yeah. Nice, thanks. And maybe lay off saying shank you if you're not into fighting. The guy might get the wrong idea. The fuck is he has no teeth? Uh, yeah, shanks. I, uh, I mean, uh, shank your eyes. Any more questions? Was that three? That was one more. Yeah, Fucking... one more. They can be mad. Hey, what's the, so the the changing card thing? That's it. Just changes the the picture on it, or does it actually change properties of the card? Just changes the picture, I think. I think oh really? Thing. And yeah, it was an attack card. <gasps> Ooh. Yeah. Personally, I don't like her better than Axel, but you know, whatever. I'm going for like actual unique cards uh, that are not the defaults on each. Yeah, the which, yeah. Uh, so the only it's default left new. is still on this guy. Yeah, we got more than one <laughs> alternate for each like category then. I got uh, two alternates here. Okay. Oh no! Saki bread. But the things I have cinnamon rolls I could eat. Think about that tomorrow. Sounds good. I'm pretty big into the cinnamon rolls. Oh yeah, I can go for some cinnamon rolls. That sounds nice. They're great. Anyways, now we continue with the plot. Since uh Our Lagoon, a cackle post. <laughs> Compet the turtle. <gasps> hey. <clears throat> Steam. There's a lot of failures there, but uh, first time, so. Yeah.
hydrate. You gotta drink that water. Yeah. You gotta do it. Uh, I might go straight to bed after this. With the EPs? Yeah. You got the bad EPs. More running shoes. Weirdly, I'm having the opposite of that today. Like, I'm not feeling particularly energized, but some force that I cannot describe compelled me to get up at like 7.30 a.m. And so I've been up since then. Huh. And like, I don't necessarily feel any more like weary for it. Even though that means I only got like four hours sleep last night. Oh. It's something going on with this. I don't know what. Might be yeah, I don't know. Is. I don't know if I'm still thrown off uh, staying up till like 3am on Monday night. Or... Level up. If it was uh, just because of something else. Oh, oh, big yawn. Oh, the big yawn. There it is. There it is, the big yawn. Yeah, I did it. I got the big yawn out. We're good. I can live again. Yay. Vincent? Oh. Shit, was I? Was I this one? I don't know. You are now. <laughs> Judith! I'm, I'm looking for a short kid. Purple flames toss too much worthy. <laughs> Yar! Welcome to our lagoon archipelago. A vast ye land lover. What did you just call me? It, it, nothing. It was a, a standard greeting. I say it to everyone who walks by. Everyone, huh? Then start talking. Which way did Jester go? Oh, I ain't seen nobody like that, I swear. My shift only started half an hour ago. Listen up, bladder war. Tell me where that punk is or there'll be trouble. Bullying civilians, number one. Quiet, kid. The adults are talking. I, I promise if I'd seen a short purple guy, I'd tell you. You heard him, bully. Leave him alone. Hmm. <laughs> You kids are so naive. Didn't anyone ever tell you? Criminals lie. Are you okay? Shiver me timbers. Thanks to ye. I'm not shark bait today. Darn tourists always freaking me out. Mention the short purple guy? Um, she's just looking though. Probably doesn't really have any idea where the fucker is. Yeah. No, I know, but I mean, is it, is it like the bird was lying? Did see Jester go by? I doubt it. It's like, who's Jester? As opposed to like, no, I, I haven't seen a little purple guy. And sometimes you just don't see a little purple guy. Yeah. Anyways, this is the one you can do the pur the blue potion on. Mmm. Lotion, in other words. God dang it. Make, sh make sure you put on your lotion every day. Keep your skin yeah. smooth. That the sentient coconut does so much damage. Oh no, well.
Oh, I swears. These land lovers be no joke. It's kind of fucked up, but like, when your throat's kind of not feeling super great, it's actually like room temperature water that does it the most soothe when like cold feels the most refreshing. Uh huh. Like, I kind of hate it. I don't have a problem with room temperature water. I mean, neither do I, but like, you know, it's the, the inherent contrast between like the most soothing and most refreshing options are not the same thing, you know? Like, it's, it's weird. It's like my parts of my brain are like all scattered. Maybe. No, I just, uh, just did the thing. You did the thing? Oh, you did the thing. Uh, I don't know about this whole potion system. It's like, I try to get to the one form, and it could take like <laughs> 20 minutes at least, and like a thousand mm. points. And then someone just comes along and instantly pops it away. I mean, I can lower the cost requirement. That's no problem. Mm. I mean, yeah, it'll it'll make it easier, of course, for uh, you know for people to sabotage. But at the same time, it'll also make it be easier for people to like de sabotage. So. Well, that's maybe the thing, though. Is currently, what was sabotage being so easy anyway? Maybe better to have it at a lower cost. Yeah. Just the free for all. Be yeah, but, but I mean, because it's I'll like, like 150 points is not really prohibitive. Right. But, like, you know, oh. like, yeah, if you're saying, like, you can take it lower, then, like, I mean, I'd say do it. One second. What we really need is more emotes that we can unlock. What social media services do I frequently use? They don't have an option that is none. <laughs> uh, Makes me sad. Okay, wait, they count Discord, so I guess I'll go with that. Ah, uh, yeah. <sighs> but yeah, again, it's the... The, pro the problem with wanting to do uh, uh, a C like f uh, progressive transformations uh, yeah. with also allowing it to be, you know, multiple instead of just like, one set. Because I wouldn't have this uh, problem if it was just like, oh, pit, you just pick the form straight out. All right. So when are you going to go underwater? Ah, oh, it's a pirate. It's, got... it's a global cooldown on an option. Yeah, I don't know. It, it, it's hard to say, because it's also like... Well, what if, like... Progress was kind of saved between forms, and then we kind of ran on parallel tracks. So it's like if you get progress towards one, and you just switch to that, the next form from whatever it was before, without like resetting both. But I don't know if that's a good solution. Really. Yeah, I mean, part of my thought process was also cutting some of the, uh, uh, trimming the branches so they're not as long. 
Like, have the cat potion instead of going to the elf first, just have it go to the cat boy one. And then uh, there's one of the dragon forms that's kind of just a bit too, like, samey between the phases that I think I could probably cut to right. reduce them down to five instead of six. That'd probably be a good idea as well for, like, if you're doing future forms, you're not, like, locking yourself into a six-stage TM. Yeah. yeah. I don't know, it's all still very experimental. Yep. Oh. Of course, I always have to ask at the end of these damn surveys, fucking... Uh, what, what, uh, you know, what conventions have you ever attended? Like, the one I've ever been to is never on the list. There's, uh, uh there's Sasuke, but we're gonna Suzuki. avoid talking to him for the hot moment. Suzuki. Think there'll be a sixth area on the map? Maybe? Oh, Romeo and Julio. Oh, hell yeah. I can go with that. I feel like Julia. Inevitably, we'll get whoever has the hook ability for those little hook shots. Okay, very interesting. Oh, they saw in their code. Thaumaturgic energy localized into Th the oceanic. Thaumaturgic, thaumaturgic energy. Uh, oceanic vicinity. Mm hmm. So, the sunstone shard is in the sea. But where? We'll need to triangulate these results successfully. That's the subaquatious signal. Yep. Math. You got a math for sure. We can, however, confirm that this is the correct ocean. Beautiful. Right. They got it narrowed down all right. I say it's no good. We're too far away. We need to get closer. Preposterous. The sun's isn't waterproof. How about a boat? What? You're right, Bob Gun. We need a shield. And a ship needs a captain. Excellent. Be so good as to find us one, old chum. Uh, uh, a ship or a captain? Oh, I know this one. Well, what do you call a captain without a ship? We be washed up. What's the thing? Unemployed. If this were a mystery uh, novel, then I bet the local tavern owner would knows everything about what goes on in this town. 
you know, this uh, pirate's tavern, which is going to be actually very kind of clean and straight lines and mocha. Yeah. favorite show Velma season 2 premiered on Max April 25th well that hasn't oh, happened yet in. so there's still time to avoid the bad future I guess yeah Yeah, it's very, like, uh... Instead of watching film, uh, watch Smiling Friends. I don't know. Watch Centaur World on loop for the rest of your life. Sure, it's a better show than Velma. I mean, that doesn't take much. Apple! Yeah. Uh, he Here's looks a... very... Is that Grandpa Smith? Sour. Here's a man who looks apple. like an apple. It really hey. is. I will love it. <gasps> no, Palmer, please. Come on. No, 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 you can't. You can't be this way. No, I've tolerated so, so many pointlessly contrary opinions already. Please, come on. Not Centaur World, please. I'm begging you. I'm begging you here. I'm begging you, Palmer. He's not even really asking, Vincent's not really asking you to, you know, like it or even watch it. Just not preclude the idea of ever watching it. Yeah, pretty much. And yeah, no, I get hating art style, though. I absolutely do get that. It is why I will also, like, never watch, like, Code Geass or... Yeah. You know, whatever. But still, I mean, if it helps, there are two art styles, though, so, yeah, the predominant one is the sillier one. Yeah. There's the one that's like, uh, on the, the Legend of Korra art style. Vaguely. <laughs> Whatever you'd call it. Th yeah. That's more of We Have Korra at Home. Anime esque. It's not, no, I wouldn't say it's anime esque, but it's, it's more like. Oh, you're right. It's not like anime -esque. It's like... There is something I think else you could compare it to, but for the life of me, I can't think of what right now. I mean, God no um, oh, you know what? It probably like the um, uh, uh, Shira. Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah. Shira, it's it's Shira. That's it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, cause I was thinking it's like it's something else that's like modern. I know people are watching. Yeah. Yeah. Point is, West uh, Cap Coast, northeast to Palm Rock Isle, southeast the Flight of Fancy. The yeah, point is, it's it's got some crazy good songs in it in the in the center world. So, if nothing else, definitely uh, just find a playlist of all the songs. I have them posted up for free from the oh. Netflix people. Hey, Palm, uh, it's your other, it's your other favorite character. And, uh, oh yeah, here here's some song for you. Hey there, little dudes song. and dudettes. Come to catch some waves, you pick the right place, my war little warrior buds. The best spot in the country to ride a gnarly heavy wave. One time I got wiped out and spun in the wa uh, washer so hard I wound up in a different continent. It was awesome. Nothing like it, just the wind on your hair, the surf, uh, some sick barrels coming off point, blank, uh, point break. Been no wind today though, just flat as glass out there. Sunrise says set, it's all what it's about. In between, just straight napping in the warm sands. <laughs> what do you mean now? Also, is that your best, like, surfer dude? Yeah, bruh. Bruh. <laughs> like, Way out on the point, 
you know? Yeah, it's the best server dude you're getting on a budget. <laughs> but... That, that's special. Yeah, I was gonna say, like, you believe in polyamory now, like, like you didn't before. But yeah, no, you mean as in you believe in polyamory now. Not, do you believe in polyamory now? <laughs> ah, as in, like... Theoretically okay with polyamory, now. except now there's a concrete target. Yeah. Yeah, Pa, just like get out there, you know? The Who knows there? Them. Thieves and skullbuggers! He's dead. Huh? Okay, no, he's just Hey. The winds blow, skullduggery of bones. Aye, tis true, true. Dark days are these, me lads. Uh, uh, well, if ye aren't here to blow me down and steal me lucky charms, what up? What do ye want? Um, we're looking for a captain. Shiver me timbers! So you're looking to join me crew? But, uh, uh, do you think you have what it takes to be a pirate? Yes. First, you need to answer me questions like a true pirate would. You overheard the swabby sp uh, uh, spreading bleach in the bleach? How are you uh, punishing the blaster uh, for his uh, for his insolence? Bilge. Keel Hall, uh, the hornswoggler, or I raise the matter with, with HR. HR. I mean, logically, yes. A uh, storm's a brewing, ye timbers are shivering. Uh, you'll be shark bait for before the night is through. What do you do? Up anchor. Uh, stow the mainsail. Haul wind. Check the manual. Call the coast guard. <laughs> ye might ruined on a desert island. What the record have ye brought with to keep ye spirits high? None. We sing she shanties. Uh, tricky one. Ultimate funk 86. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. yeah. This is a great time for music. I he pirate blood in thee, and make no mistake, I'll consider ye a proposal. Meet me aboard uh, my pride and joy, the flight of fancy. The flight of fancy. Hey. Aw, hanging from the jib. What? Oh, don't what worry about it. Aw, make a book of the plank. <laughs> Gonna kill you. <laughs> well, blow me down for an old sea cart. <laughs> Go back to Sunny. Hey, him be one sort of fancy lad. The seas be a crew, mistress, and he not be respecting them. Be respecting them women. He not be drinking his juice. This hydrate is for me. <sighs> Two. Ah, oh, I've got another five years of rum drinking before I can do a pirate voice. Well, that's All the babies. time. Pretty sunny, yeah. Reasonably so. Reasonably sunny. In Philadelphia. I love the show, It's Reasonably Sunny in Philadelphia. A story about a bunch of people who, like, you know, sometimes make bad decisions, but are ultimately normal and well adjusted good people. <laughs> and then the Patty's Pub crew ransacks their homes and fucking. Commit yeah. some crime. Uh, aggravated assault. They cause the building collapse. We're a series of shenanigans. Yeah, there'd be too many shenanigans about for me, like. There really do be a lot of shenanigans about, though. 
Just... Er, we be in the pirate section of the game. Wait, wait. Okay. Uh, there's Sasuke. We got the yeah. Sasuke. Anyways, let me go. Ah, uh, okay. Little... Talk to this little bird here and then do the. Well, what have you land lovers learned? What else have you learned? Nothing. Hey, that's it. This must be what the captain was trying to tell me. Huh. Er, don't ask me how it be working. Or if in there be more than one shop. Oh, which is you could be using that there discount on. A blooper. Not a blooper. Yeah, he ate the blooper. No. Why was there an arrow like you could give it to? Oh, yeah. They have their own health. Not that mm -hmm. I've really seen them attacked. We all have our own health. Yeah, they attack whoever's in front, but uh. We all kinda, have our own health. And, it kind of uh, doesn't matter. It's you all got the shit. Avast, ye scurvy land lover. Relax, ye muscles. The balance comes from the core, not from ye legs. Mm -hmm, that is true. It'd be easier to concentrate if you didn't insult me so much. Arr! You wouldn't last five minutes at sea with your skin thinner than the mist on a mainsail. He asked for this old sea dog's help, and that's what I'm giving you. Oh. Fucking face. Uh, Kekyoi, didn't you say you head to our lagoon to find Serenity or something? I don't think that Serenity means what you think it means. No, it totally does. It means being calm, at peace. Yeah, yeah, I know. I tried sitting on the beach watching the waves, but it got kind of, well, boring. Yeah. So I asked Cry, who trained me in the art of seafaring piracy, to broaden my horizons. <laughs> you could never sit still for long. When we were kids, you used to get in trouble because you kept jumping around during the LLAMA tournament. I remember, I was always sticking my hoof in it. At least I grew out of it for the most part. Gosh. You're saying that I didn't? What? No, I didn't mean that. Why do you always insist on misinterpreting everything I say and do? It actually occurred to you that I... <sighs> you know what? Never mind. I guess you'll wanna fight me again now, right? Mm-hmm. Hmm, I don't know. We've done so much fighting, I kind of lost my appetite for it. Oh, that's a shame. Thought you might have grown as a warrior to take on this quest, but I guess I was wrong. How dare you! I try to give you a chance, and you just throw it back in my face! Well, look at that. I just got my hunger back. Like... Right? <laughs> We're doing this again. Hoping to avoid getting even more hot bothered. <laughs> oh well. He has the the the, the snun glasses or either that or double eye patches now. I believe the sunglasses is indicated by the one uh, little like white dot on each. Yeah. Well, uh, res of the day news. God damn you. Aha! I get another one.
I you the, don't expect me to do it again. The strategy isn't working for you, do, you dude. No, it, it's he, he's doing the Elven Ring strategy. Just keep using summons. I. <laughs> Okay, if this is how you want to go down. Yeah, this is his uh, meditative uh, stance to fighting. Well, he had at least four there. Okay. <laughs> I'm a sick. You guys really become a team. Oh god! How many times are we gonna do this, Catcoy? How many times have we gotta beat you? That's up to you, buddy. Did you pick up what I was trying to teach you? You teach me? We beat you. You defeated me, so I'm not worth learning from, huh? I guess I answered that. I think I'm done with my training tour. I'm gonna head home. Maybe I'll see you round. Is this me or did Kakoi seem a bit, I don't know, defeated? For once. Well, we have beaten him four times now. But yeah, I know what you mean, Lin. He didn't seem himself. He's just like, fuck this, I'm going home. You know what I don't get? Just when it seems we might be getting somewhere, he says something to wind me up. I need to ask him about that. This is gonna end with the kiss, isn't it? Oh, I hope so. Yeah. It should. Anyway, I have given feedback for the first batch of bionicle parts that I've received. Oh, hell yeah. That's all that matters. Yep. Okay. Uh... I am missing a couple things, but I have most of what I need to make Black Tahu. Mm hmm. Very good, very, very, very good, very good. The, the Tahu. Black Tar yes. Tahu? Yeah. I, uh, I already mentioned the issue with the with the flame sword, though, right? No, I don't think so. Uh... Oh. Well, one of the issues with my plans to make the entire Tahu rainbow is that uh, the the flame sword doesn't exist in very many colors at all. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I could I could see that being. Black Tahu will be entirely completable. But uh, most of the other ones won't. I'm gonna have to get like different weapons. Oh. Or I could get red swords and then like paint spray them. paint them. Yeah. I wouldn't want to do that with other swords. Ooh, or maybe I could resin print swords in Ooh. a different color. Yeah, just get the deets for uh, for just the one sword make it yourself. Yeah. Uh, market. Bionicle. Speaking of sending in feedback, I finally did the fucking survey for FGO. Just to get, oh, like, fuck, right. Just to get, like, four tickets to throw in for uh, no more. No. Yeah. I got it. I'm gonna do the survey. Forgot about that. Mm. Uh, user survey six. There we go. User survey. User ID. Five. Hey, you remember how we were talking about uh, Gotcha at the beginning of the stream? Yeah. No. You know, look, because self demonstrating. Oh, I'm gonna shit my head. Like, uh, oh, actually. Oh, we're stuck. We're stuck in the void. 
Pere, 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 pere. Nationality, United States. Oh, hi. I was wondering if you turn up. But you want to fight me again, don't you? Prove you're stronger than me. Come on, Kekoi. What's this all about? What are you waiting for? I'm ready for you. No. Not this time. You're the strongest warrior I know. But fighting you again won't prove anything. I see. You finally realized, huh? Yeah, you've been trying to annoy me into fighting you every step of the way. You're right. I have been goading you. Goading? I I wanted to see how strong you are. I wanted to see you better yourself. Uh, goats. Didn't need me to do that. You've grown into a formidable warrior. I found people willing to fight alongside you. I always thought you and I would do that together. Figured we were the only ones that could push each other to become better people. I... I don't know what to say. I thought... I kind of thought you hated me. Idiot! How many times did I carry your exhausted butt back to the village after you trained so hard you passed out? You don't just magically wake up in bed, you know? Like that he's realizing it now, he's like, oh, but really? <laughs> I You really thought you just magically woke up in bed, didn't you? I don't know why, but that I guess all caps Uh got that listed as a mod. Wow. Kind of. Yeah. <laughs> Doggy, what? you showed me that I need to forge a new path. Focus less on training, more on what matters most. The people around me. This place here was going to be a martial arts dojo. I started building it, but then I realized I couldn't teach aspiring fighters and run the dojo by myself. That's why I traveled the kingdom. I wanted to improve my fighting skills Find someone, a partner, to run this dojo with me. Eventually, I realized that the right person had been in front of me all the time. I just couldn't see it. I don't know how you couldn't. I mean, look at these fucking faces he's doing. What are you saying, Kekoi? I want you to be that partner, Yagi. Will you run the dojo with me? Pass on our knowledge to goats who aspire to enter the LLMA tournament? You want me? Even after all this? Of course. You've always been trying to prove that you're a great warrior to everyone around you. But the only one you needed to prove it to was yourself. Uh. It's an important lesson. And who better to teach it to the next generation than someone who learned the hard way? So, what do you say? Will you run the dojo with me after your quest? Maybe I don't always understand you, but I know I'd rather have you as a friend than a rival. Just... that mean you'll join me? My very own dojo? Of course! Think of the battles, the tournaments! We'll get to name our own fighting style. I have an idea for that, actually. The way of the goat! Yes! Only... not yet. I'm still on a quest, and I promised these guys we'd see it through to the end. When we save the world, we'll talk, okay? Take it one step at a time. Well, bang, okay. Huh. When did you become so level-headed? <laughs> Sounds fair to me. You're all ballin'. Good luck on your quest, all of you. Your what friend has is that, not... God? Your friend has not learned a valuable lesson. What the hell is happening? Take him to God. <laughs> Just, okay, dear God, the amount of, like, unresolved homoeroticism in that. Right. 
Was that the Lord Archon in the highest? Shadow, what are we gonna call our fighting style? Scrange. And we have unlocked the Mind Prison, because that's where Yagi is still trapped in. Yeah. Sword. <clears throat> Swords. Okay, yes, it comes in red, black, and medium blue. Yeah, I'm disappointed as well. Yeah. Like, I'm not surprised, but I am disappointed. Well, we're not at the end of the game yet. Who knows? It's I gonna know, like but like... The, the, the game has yet to actually, uh... Like... There isn't really any queer likeness in the text or subtext of the game other than the shonen ass shonen shit we just saw. So I'm not at yeah. all surprised. I mean, ah. yeah, they were able to push this game into somewhat mainstream awareness. That means it uh, can't have anything to it. Yeah, I mean that, and also if there was anything gay in it, I would have already heard about it. That is also true. You would have heard about it before it even was an idea in the developers' minds. Because they were going for shonen anime rivals, which is um, very homoerotic, but it's not intentional, question mark? <laughs> which is, tell me you're gay in like a thousand words without actually saying you're gay. Bro, I love you like a bro, bro. This is a nice boat you have here. Aye, she is that. The finest gal you'd ever sail the seven seas. I'm gonna give you so many kisses. Has it ever bro sailed? Kisses. Sailed? Has it ever sailed? She sailed, sunk, been scuttled, surfaced, and sailed again. I truth be told, she has a few holes down below. I have a few bro holes down below. That doesn't sound Whoa. ideal. That's literally just chewed from 16. <laughs> and some sways in her stays. Oh no. Oh no. Out of shudder in her rudder. Bummer. Her flag's a rag. <laughs> Alex? <laughs> her hull is dull, her deck is a wreck. Even the sail is pale! And without a crew, what can I do? I can help you. Excellent! Excellent! Uh, I mean... Yar! As, uh, uh, your good set of deck swabbers I ever pressed into service. Welcome to me, crew! Speak to me when you're ship shape and we'll hoist to the mainsail. Hoist! This is your last chance to go ashore. Yeah, you'll be locked into a little sequence, probably. Jude is aggressively stoner gay. Also, oh, didn't... Bruh. When they made the, uh... Uh, Totally Drama Babies edition, didn't they include him for some reason? Excuse me, what? Do you not know about Total Drama for Babies? It's called Total Drama Rama. What the fuck? Yeah, look it up, it's real. No, no. It's just the no. it's just the entire cast as babies except like Chef, who's the daycare owner. Oh my God! What the fuck? Uh, and yeah, Jude from to from sixteen, I think, is also included, just randomly what? as one of the babies. How the f do they get turned into babies? What the fuck? No, it's just the <laughs> it's just, just the settings. Just they're they're babies. Put them up the babies. Yeah, put them up the babies. Uh, well, yeah, we're gonna have but, but, but an they, animated contestant show, and then but, just keep the same contestants. But they just, but, but like, like, they, they didn't know each other before the first season, right? That yes, was thing? yes, it doesn't matter. What ma the fuck? Alex, it doesn't matter. The, the, ah. Like, fucking Total yeah. Drama is a reality competition show that's animated. It is deliberately a farce. Also, like, do you want canon with Total Drama? <laughs> yeah. No! Like, who gives a shit? I'm <laughs> Look, you, you can't just you can't just say like I oh, what you actually care about the thing in the first place for, for 
wanting some kind of continuity. No. It's ridiculous. No, see, it's, it's a name that he recognized. Uh, let's, let's, let's make another thing with the name. It doesn't really have to have anything to do with the original. Yeah, I mean, it has the same up. cast, just they're all babies now, because uh, d d d d who watches cable television anymore but babies? Well, uh, old people, but... Old people and babies, but also no, like, a, sh a cartoon about old people doesn't sell. Yeah... The Big Blue true. is calling me. It's time to sail as the crew flies. Miss King of the Hill. <laughs> <laughs> old people uh, don't watch cartoons. Rock! Straight to rock bottom. Why anchor you scurvy dogs? Trim the sails! Uh... Is he talking to us? Yeah, also Palmer, it's called Q-Force, obviously. <laughs> and yeah, Laffy Taffy, we were talking about Total Drama Babies. Uh-huh, yeah, uh, better. I don't think so. Now, bring me that horizon! Bro, we're crow pirates, not copycats. Oh, I, uh, aim for the skyline! That being what? The biggest supporter of Q-Force, all those, uh, femphobic loser gays online shitted on it. Now I don't even have that. Yeah, Trevor, did you watch, did you watch Q-Force? Cause... <laughs> I was lurking and just heard the conversation a lot, waiting for a match in my game, and why, lord? <laughs> yeah, how did you like it? You force. Anyway, Alex, do the Professor Rose voice. I hear something is working. Whoa. <laughs> what? But Joe, we're right on top of it. We'll need to dive down to get the shot. A voyage to the bottom of these brainy depths is that? Is it? Down to David Dunn's locker. Aww. Move! How long can you hold your breath underwater, old chap? Ages inside a submarine. Submarine, eh? First thing we got is this glass bottom boat. For the tourists, of course. Yar, but I have just the thing for ye. There be a diving suit in the lockers down below. They're old, mind you. They're kinda leaky. Mm, heavy as lead. But you're free to use them. Oh, very generous. Uh, Unstoppable on wheels or high heels. Oh my god, Sinclair, yes, that's genius. We need that. We need, like, the fucking the drag speed racer show right now. From hell or yeah. high heels. But yeah, because I, I had heard most people say that, like, who had actually watched the show, that it was, you know, good for what it was. And just a lot of people hating on it because... Yeah, that trailer I saw, that trailer did not sell it well. Uh, should you plunder any booty? Cut this old sea crow some piece of eights for your coffin, eh? Uh, this feels like a one-way ticket to a bad idea convention. But I'm very fond of air, and any diving suit is better than no diving suit. Really? Because again, I, the, the trailer left a very bad impression to me. Oh yeah, we have to remember actually. With, with Palmer, bad is good and good is bad. God damn so. it! They're here. Oh, fuck! They're here. <laughs> oh, we were ahead of your chumps once again. <laughs> Bet you saw uh, saw the, thought you saw the last of us, suckers. you surprised so I don't know if there's more than one trailer I'm referring to the one that like spends the entire conversation where like mostly is the scene of the main character guy giving the speech where he comes out publicly but then is like shoved back in the closet or whatever by the peoples around him which uh <sighs> the I rewatching not rewatching god no, not rewatching. But watching the uh, the Quentin video on the Beverly Hillbillies. 
uh, most of which reminds me of the kind of like humor that I can't stand, which is Nick, which is like I can't stand cringe-based humor just because it's uncomfortable, and I'm like, uh, or anything that has to do um, with miscommunication, which isn't really a Q Force thing. I'm assuming that's just a that's a old sitcom ass shit. It's so annoying. Uh, oh. I mean, I don't mind like a miscommunication-based thing. It's pretty simple, but you know, it's it's somehow it's handled. Certainly, it's, a, it's a device for setting up jokes. It's not a joke in and of itself, is the thing. Yeah, but it's just it's it's frustrating and it stresses me out personally. I don't find humor in miscommunication. Right. Huh. Oh wait, are we talking about the are we talking about the annoying writing thing where characters just mishear each other and then they try to make a plot out of that? Pretty much. I fucking hate that shit. Uh, huh. uh Vincent. What I already said that. Aren't you surprised? I think we're starting to expect it, to be honest. Shut up, warm out! Yeah, we'll do the talking around here. And, uh, yes, Palmer, I don't, I don't read or watch a lot of Yaoi for, for a lot of reasons, that's one of them. <laughs> and the gem collecting! These diving suits are ours, suckers! The ones with giant holes? What? What holes? Oh. Alright, four summon tickets, yippee! It'll be fine, if you were planning on doing much breathing. Whatever time for plan B! Mutiny! Line up on deck before we make you walk the plank! He means before we tie you up, stopping you from diving off the plank to get to the sunstone shad. It's not that I think I'm better than you for it, it's just... There are certain tropes and things I don't like in fiction. And unfortunately, a lot of Yaoi, despite being, you know, about two guys hooking up effectively, includes a lot of tropes that I don't like. So I don't watch it or read it. But you gotta. No. Uh... Next. It's a Next. Yeah, that's what I meant. Shit, fuck, ass. Uh, Next. how do we get the shard then, boss? You know, I've been feeling stronger with each piece of the sunstone we found. Maybe instead of us going down to it, I can bring it up here. Yeah, shit beats going for a permanent swim. He's concentrating. It's just taking a little shit over there. Mm. Nice. I like it when I don't gotta do nothing. Mm. Mecha whale? What? But Joe, what is that? Uh, sink me! Uh, we have ventured into the treacherous trapezoid, from which sailors ne'er return. That's a little farther to the left. Then what is it? Oh, is it wind? Yeah, it was, but whatever. Yeah. Then Alex. He appears to be as you. What the fuck? Filling up to a muscular. Filling up to a muscular sword. Oh, well. Oh, well. Of course. Oh. Hey, uh, who is reading Moby Dick? Me. Good, because uh, this is actually Pinocchio. Pinocchio. Just, uh, are we inside the whale? It worked! I did it! You saying you meant for us to get eaten? What? No! I can feel the shard! It's close by! 
Okay, would it be hilarious if we got the shard and left before uh, this lot even woke up? Yeah, then we wouldn't have to fight them. <laughs> yeah, and they'd be trapped here. I guess. I mean, they'd probably escape, right? Then we need to make sure they can't follow us. More traps! Um, sure. Hey, isn't it weird there's tons of junk in here? Perfect! We can use that to make the traps! <laughs> Jester? Are you okay? You're always asking dumb questions, Alfie. How about you stay here and set up the traps? The Sid and I will go get our sunstone shot. Yeah. <laughs> Fine. Keep snoozing, keep losing, short stack. He's taller than you, Jester. Hey, can we wake up, everyone? Oh, splendid! You're all alive! Uh, who ordered seafood? Me. Hey, what I did on summer vacation essay is going to be interesting this year. What do you call a fish breath, but for your whole body? It's not you, Lynn. It's this plice. This plice. Oh, he's so thrifty. <laughs> this smell is casting a wide net. Yeah? If you're trying to bait me into punning, you've got me hook, line, and sinker. Do you think Jester and Co. got gobbled up too? Definitely. Those bullheads wouldn't miss a chance to muscle in on a piece of sunstone. So if we bait them, we can reel in the catch of the day. We just have to find them before they find the, the shard. That's wildly different voice there, sorry. Gobbog. Alex? You smell like this. Incredible. These things can talk. I wonder what they're saying. Mm, now me hungry. <laughs> I love them. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, it's standard dialogue. Where's the captain? Oh, captain, my captain. <laughs> get, get it, it's a reference. It's not even a joke, it's just a reference. It's They say the line in the movie, and I said it now. Yeah. I fucking love the line in the movie. Is that again, like Dead Poets Society or whatever? Yeah. Yeah, I don't remember what the movie's called. I just uh -oh. remember that I liked it. You know, I had like an eighth grade teacher whose like whole thing was the Dead Poets Society. I think that's a lot of teachers. Like he um did the whole thing about the barbaric yop of the soul or whatever. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And it was like. Uh, I probably could have got like a hundred in that class if I had just watched the movie. <laughs> I could like quote it back to him. Mm. It, it flip flop. Baby girl. I think it's a boy. I'll call you Greeny. Whatever. Uh, bro. Oh, teleporters. In a whale. Turner. Timmy Turner? From the Hooch. whale? From the hooch. Grow up, Timmy Turner? That'll never age Mib. poorly. Mib takes grab. Wait, who aged poorly? Uh, Drake Bell. Uh, oh, that. Oh, I forgot. Oh, I forgot about that. Drake Bell, everyone's favorite pedophile. Drake? Actually, my favorite pedophile is Big Boss. That's, mmm, that's, that's, we kinda have to say it now, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> uh... Muda da da Yeah.
RP. RP. You should, but you you haven't. RP. Go through the teleporter to the left. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to see how to, I'm trying to figure out how to get up to the guy up there. Go around, probably. Unless you just can just jump away. Oh, it's a sick um, crab! <laughs> furry species for a one piece. Furry exclusive. Furry. Uh, well, what do you have so far? Say it. I'm gonna say something that goes without saying, but like, just yes. gonna say it anyway so that it can be out there and noted. Currently, a uh, hobbitrot looping the berserker node. Yes! As God fucking intended. Really did. Ah. What's a Harvey? Is that a thing? What? I might be learning something here. Oh. Oh, in the chat. Uh, I can... No. Harpy. Ah, uh, yes. Okay, that makes sense. Ah. Of course. Laffy Taffy's goal here is to make Kitty. My god, they're gonna do it. Pretty based, you know? Mink, uh, I haven't seen that arc. I guess Palmer hasn't either. It's a later edition. Oh, well, yeah, there's that, Palmer. Are you, uh, still before the time skip? Hundred forty. Oh well, you're not catching up anytime soon. Well, you're not catching up, and that's it. You don't need to put an anytime soon in there. It's just that's just reality. I mean, it's one piece. Yeah, no, exactly. No one's catching up. Yeah. <laughs> Why do I always end up butt deep in weird glow and goop? I don't. Mwah. Like that. Ah, uh, no! You stuck, little guy? I'm sorry. Let me help you. Today on the show. You know, little dude, I know how you feel. Trapped in a sticky situation you didn't sign up for. The author's thinly veiled. Like doing fetish. a terrible impression of a Harley Quinn. This is so not what I pictured when Justice said we were going to save the Empire. There you go, little fish thing. You're free now. I'm free. Wah. Wah. Shh. You're welcome, I guess. Some people, jeez. Huh? Who goes there? I'm s slowly drifting into Lois. Huh? Uh, I mean, that's kind of the same accent, more or less. Alfie, right? Yeah. What's it to you? Um, that was really nice of you to free the, uh, jellyfish? If you say anything to anyone about it, I'll Francis. sleep shut your whiny butts into the neared acid pit. Got that, twerps and twerpets? Uh, yes, ma'am. Eat it. Hater. Hater. I'm the bone of my sword. This is also like that time you were inside a giant whale. 
Yeah, I don't know. I just had a period where I like watched all of One Piece up to like uh, fucking what is the name of that arc? Ennis Lobby. Uh, and then after that, it was like I watched some of the seasons. I think I did even a bit through the time skip. Really stopped definitely at the Dressrosa part. Just like completely lost interest. Actually, what happened was I completely lost interest because there was a string of several hundred episodes where the Straw Hat crew was not together and it was like focused on Luffy. And uh, Luffy's the least interesting member of the crew. I, I'm sorry, did you just say several hundred episodes? Yeah. Well, okay, maybe like a couple hundred. It... A hundred? I don't know. So, so because Any we're talking about bad. One Piece... Any of these are bad. <laughs> because we're talking about One Piece, I have no fucking idea how hyperbolic you're being here. I'm kind of not... Well, let me see... Uh, if there's like One Piece arcs... If they give episode numbers. Um. Okay. Here we go, here we go. So, post Ennis Lobby, Thriller Park, Abode. Here we go, starting at Amazon Lily Arc, which is. This is some back of the envelope calculations, but episode 408. Through Impel Marine. Down, through Marine Bird, post-war arc, right until Fishman Island Saga, return to Sabaody, 517. So, yeah, about 110 episodes. What the fuck? <laughs> A hundred and ten episodes without the main cast even together? Yeah, that checks out. How many yeah, I mean, episodes of One Piece are there? They uh, still again, like... over a thousand. One thousand yeah. one hundred. Okay. Um, yeah, and it's like... episodes of Detective Conan are there? <laughs> uh, a thousand? How many episodes of Doraemon are there? I don't. I don't want to think about that. I don't want to think about that at all. You don't want to Steve think about know, it. You don't want the answer to that. That one's gonna haunt you. My friend Steve, he watches like all of Detective Conan. Uh, let's see here. Detective Conan. But yeah, um, yeah, with One Piece, it's like, even though they'll cut back to the crew, they're all you know separated. So it's it's like. What, four arcs where it's just kind of Luffy is the main character and then a bunch of you know other side characters. One thousand seven hundred and eighty seven Doraemon episodes. Is that Woo! is that just this current version of the character? Or you mean like literally since syndication started? Like this current version of the show. Because I know he's probably had it more than one. God dang it. What? Uh, well, that was between 1979 and 2005. I was also in that time range. Look, oh, man, he was. Aren't we all? I like the, uh, the partner just like doing a rapid drop. Yeah. As he's gliding over the pit. Drop. Drop. Make that bomb booty drop.
Can you just use the bed? Can you just jump on it? Yeah. Yeah, okay, there we go. Why wouldn't you be able to? Cool. Wait, actually. 19. Hang on a second. Okay, well then you're missing out on one thing. I, I, I thought something still felt off. I had to look it up. You're saying between 1975 and 2000, 1979 and 2005, uh, that's how many Doraemon episodes. You're missing out on the 26 1973 episodes. Gotch? Mmm. The one season? Yeah. The Biofundry. Uh is that what it said? Yeah, the biofundry. Huh. I mean, if you can't tell, this whale's like pseudo mechanical. Dude. Yeah, but I would have I mean, thought who it would have said foundry. No. But foundry, okay. Yeah, foundry is like made up and dumb. It's all about fun nowadays. That's true. Hey, let's get a uh, child labor working in this fundry. Only if it's off the coast of Costa Rica. <laughs> yeah, well, what if we had them producing Doritos in You start bags. watching one, one piece of, uh, one pace of one piece for Skypea and I'm already lost. I am lost in that sentence. Lost in the sauce. One Piece is a fan recut of One Piece to be like less episodes. Generally, I believe is that filler and repeated scenes. Is that is that even possible? Not even legal. You like, could. Is it legal? No. Like, half of infinite is still infinite. Well... Yeah. But it's... It's a half less of infinite. Right, True. it could be more infinite. <laughs> True. Be two times could infinite. Bioshock infinite. And no one wants that. True. Uh, but what if True. it were Halo infinite? True. Still, no one wants that. True. 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 Uh, and the third game with the subtitle at Infinite to complete the joke in Rule of Threes. Uh, Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite. Uh, uh, yeah, I mean, that does fit. Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. Okay. I guess. Uh, who the fuck is Rob? I'm gonna look up Rob Lucci. Turns into like a Cheeto? Oh. A Jaguar? Right, yeah, I've looked this guy up before because of Palmer. Mm -hmm. Like, I've gone through this exact thing. Well, that's not until the episodes in the 200s. And, like, the good stuff that he wants is, like, getting into the 300s. Say among us anytime you're not thinking anything. I mean, he can't. He well, was dead. Nuh uh. Like, if I did that, then I would just be saying among us constantly. 
I am ordering Taco Bell. Luffy's transforma- which transformation? Is it the one that was on the internet? Uh, yes. I mean, I guess they're all on the internet, but like the recent one? Dear yeah, Cloud Boy. I, lo I love that one. What? What, the Cloud Boy transformation? Yeah. Well, I guess to each their own. Metal Gear Rex. That's what he becomes. Shit, maybe I should watch One Piece. Why? Well, if they have Metal Gear Rex in there. And they don't. But then why would Vincent have just said that he turns into Metal Gear Rex? Yeah. What are you calling Vincent some kind of liar? Yeah. I would never lie, except about anything to do with uh, the bodies that are uh, in the floorboards. Oh, no, I, I appreciate the offer, Palmer, but I have um, negative infinite interest in watching One Piece. Not to disparage it for anyone who wants to see it, but that ain't me. Yeah, he's got hate to watch. Yeah. Uh, God, I fucking wish I had fate to watch, but no. No, that shit, they don't make infinite episodes out of. Well, yeah, because that's a finite story. Yeah. Wait, is now Blue Potion or too late? Now is Blue Potion, yeah. Uh, hit the gritty. Ooh. How far behind did my street get? Pretty far. 20 years. Sadly, you don't get any fucking cheerful cone uh... from, from that particular node. So I now have like 245 laudable cone. 417 energetic con and 84 cheerful con. <laughs> wait, meant for Alex to wait, what? For Alex. What am I saying? Yeah, what 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 are you making? What are you making him witness? Be nice to him. Some wolf girl. Oh. Oh, I see. Wait, wait, no, no, that was an unrelated DM from Mark. Oh, that's horrifying. Uh, wolf I'm rain. Probably you about wolf rain. Yeah. yeah. I like how we've just become somehow indistinguishable. Yeah. This was always the plan. It really was. Again, the, the melding of the faces and the flesh and all that. Yeah. Yeah, Wolf Rain's fucking great. One of my favorite uh, Japanese animes. Oh, yeah, sure. Be sure to check that shit out. It's, it's a good time. You just gotta... I mean, I guess I could look it up for you, but like... You gotta figure out which of the episodes are the recap ones that you can skip. So I always forget which ones they are, or what the numbers ah. are. You mean... Oh wait, no, you, you said recap, not filler. Yeah. I, I heard something about skipping episodes, and I was like, ah, yes! Uh, I don't Naruto. believe it's skipping filler. Not even, the, not even the fucking Naruto episode about the ninja ostrich? Well, I don't watch shows with bad filler. Fuck. Okay, that's a pretty important precondition there. Yeah. Uh, okay, let me make sure... I mean, I wonder... I think most, like, websites will help me just have the... Oh. ...actual episodes up. Yamato's transformation. 
Okay. All right, here's the secret, uh, Lavi and Taffy, is if you do another red potion, it will continue on the cap to you. To get that fixed. Yeah. Oh, God. Oh, no. Uh, she's here, too, somehow. Hey, yeah. <laughs> like, oh my god. Like, nope. Why? <laughs> oh my fucking god. What the fuck? I'm sorry. Why does her fucking snoot vanish entirely when you're looking at her from the front? What? Snoot. What the fuck? The, uh, the, the... Yamato transformation, whoever the fuck this is. You even had a snoot. One piece can't do proportion consistency. You don't say. <laughs> Miss Double Finger? Miss Double Finger. Oh god, I regret listening to you. Jesus <laughs> Christ. What the fuck? <laughs> like are, are y'all trying to y'all trying to convince me to watch One Piece cuz it's not working. I'm not. One one is Dragon Fruit Freeze. Uh... Okay. Yeah, hang on. You know, uh, Palmer, so if you're, uh... Uh, looking... If, if wherever you're, like, looking for, uh, for Wolf's Rain or whatever to watch it, um, I'm gonna punch in... Uh, I'll, I'll pop in a message here on the chat real quick with the episode titles. Because I don't know if the numbers would be the same, so I'm just going to put the titles in for the uh, episodes that you can go ahead and skip, and then you can, like, screenshot my message or whatever and save it if you want. Uh... Alright, hang on. I'm, I'm punching them in. The stab kiss thing from Juj... Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, by the way, uh, Palmer, uh, random ask for you. Uh, could you DM me on uh, on uh, Discord that song you made again? Cause I didn't save the link from last time, so. It really was a good song. Yeah. Anyways. Vincent? Where is he? It's next know. door. Hang on. <sighs> yeah, what are we doing? Are we doing this thing? Oh yeah, where is he? No idea who you mean, you mad old coot. Liar! You're one of the jesters and cronies. Tell me where he is. If I'm such a liar, then why bother asking me anything, huh? Hoodlum! Legabond! I'll strike you down and wipe your evil stain from this world! Eh? <laughs> nah, number one's a girl. Yeah, number one is female. Shit, hey, did it? Is she I gonna be the. Uh, hey, attacking before your opponent is ready. Where's your honor, dirtbag? I must have missed that episode then. <laughs> You, you're siding with the criminals, traitors. 
Yeah, I'm... Yeah, You dare to interrupt me, saver! Yeah, but... The question shit only says... Apprehend gesture for question. Quiet round! Do you take me for a fool? I know what this is really about. You children want to dethrone me as number one. But that'll never happen. You can't defeat me. You're generation lazy. You're all too soft to be real heroes. Why does number one have a giant fucking eye? Because one, and also uh, ego, so like eye. You're not a hero, you're a fraud. Forget yeah. Number one hero? More like no one's hero. How dare you, criminals, liars! I'll take you all down! Okay, let's see how tough. Okay. Pretty tough. Yeah. Fa a, a fair bit stronger than, uh. It's not a pushover. May need to use items in battle, or even your reserve points. Kick and kick. Ah, up defense. Okay. As opposed to hop defense. From Pokemon? Still did sex. Uh. Really? Still did four. Well, what? What? I keep doing it. I'm going to laugh if it turns out that, uh. Number one is all bark, no bite. She could be. Uh, yeah. Let's see if she actually does an attack. Okay. No? Okay. She'll punch you for a lot. If you're paying attention, uh, I'm about I'm posting now. This is the uh, list of episode titles. Just go ahead, screen cap that. Those are the ones that you skip and we'll sign. Uh, yeah, I put semicolons between each actual title because some of them have like commas in them. So yeah, it's just four that were made as recap episodes because of the SARS pandemic. Uh, so they are not really to be counted as proper episodes anyway. It was just you know. No one could actually do any work because people were dying. I have Dr. Pepper! <laughs> Jesus, uh, that's a good thing to know. We did it. <laughs> oh. Uh. uh. Have a nice trip, lady. Drop yeah, us no a problem, postcard problem. from Whale Butt. Whale Butt postcard. It's a nice place to spend the fall. <laughs> She'll be at home there. It stinks. Look how you just always have really good options. 
Seriously, though. Who was that? Yeah. Number one hero. She took out the Saber Guild contract to catch Jester. Whoa. So she really was hunting him? And she tracked us all the way here? Hold up, though. She's on your side. So why'd you help me, huh? You want to stop Jester, not hurt you. You could have fooled me. Yo and Klein came back pretty roughed up. They started it. Why are you all trying to stop us anyway, huh? What's any of this got to do with you? Oh, uh, Jester's plan, using the Sunstone to bring back the Empire, it will destroy everything. It'll break the world. You don't know that. None of us know how to work. Jester hasn't talked about the plan with you. With his friends? Of course he has. Well, a bit. Kinda. Jester just wants to fix things. To let us all go home. Or at least, that's what I used to think. I know this is important to him, but he's been really off. What do you mean, off? You know, muttering, ranting, obsessing, leaving his friends behind, letting Klein and Io get hurt. <laughs> he doesn't seem to care about anything but the Sunstone now. It's definitely gone under the lowest voice. <laughs> I can't maintain it. It's hard when you try to help someone, but they won't listen. It's hard when no one will take you seriously. It's hard being away from your family. Undead roam the Ember Ruins. So you saw them too, huh? Those soldiers? I don't want to live in an empire that could create them. It's not too late. We could stop this. We could still change his mind. We gotta try to get through to Jester. If you speak to him, Alfie, maybe he'll realize he has people who care him about him right here. I can't believe I'm about to do this. I recognized it. Yes. Okay, mm. let's try it. If we're gonna work together, you should know that my guitar. That's a what? guitar. The anchor on her back is a guitar. It doubles as a uh, grappling hook. Well, it is an anchor, so yeah. I can hook and move us to metal rings and snatch goodies from afar. Now let's get moving. I didn't even fight her. Yeah. So first things first. Okay, so metal and fire. Oh shit. I'm starting to regret taking on the girls' voices for this game. Oh well. We'll push through it. Shit. Vampire Survivors is doing a collaboration with Konami. Honestly, Konami. right now, it's just that I'm kind of very tired and my voice is starting to go. Yeah. I know, I don't do good, good girl voices, but you know, whatever. Okay, but indeed. Shaw. Shaw. Oh, you have four, so just pick the two you don't like. Or it, does that is that between uh, that's, that's between yeah that's between everybody. Oh okay, never mind. What part of that is a guitar? The 
hard. You know. That one. We may be in here. Oh, you want to end here? Oh yeah, we've been going for about four hours and some change. I'd keep yeah. close to five. And yep. some change. Yeah. Yeah, biofoundry. You're in the wild. Yeah, hold a bit back. Hey, new partner. Yep. Uh, we'll probably end up finishing this next time. Finishing as... the whale. Yeah, as we. Well, hopefully, I'll kind of feel better next week, and then yeah, be able to go longer. Yeah, we get through the whale section and uh, whatever the end game is, because uh, I mean, we have everybody. There's not much else left to do. Probably the underground palace, which. Uh... Thousand year door watch. I mean, yes. Wow, 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 wow. You said not to compare them. Yeah, but, you know. You lied. <laughs> at, at some point. Hey, hey she's on the title screen. Yep. Fuck up. It's Cyclops. Anyway, Alex, did you order Taco Bell? Yes. Alright, cool. Of course. But yeah, yeah, she's a crew member. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, he is now. the last like fifteen minutes or ten minutes. Yep, we, yeah. we, we got her on board now. She was a bad guy. It's, it's like a weird. Well, no, so... it's clearly doing the thing. You know, to do the thing again, the comparison to Paper Mario. There's like the team of bad guys, but most of them aren't really evil. You know, that sort of deal. They're doing that. Yeah. Uh, like again. From, I, I guarantee you that when the end it's gonna turn out that like again Je we're gonna redeem Jester and most of his group because they're not really bad people. But then no, we're, they're not. Yeah. Yeah. Then we're yeah. gonna have to go fight his dad who gets resurrected and is like the final boss. Yeah. Again, it's 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 the witches with the big evil like super Once, witch at the end. Yeah. yeah Bread the undead over it, the world. Except for like in that case. Like, one which was good, one was just kind of dumb, and one was just actually a terrible person. Yeah. But, like, you know, it's, like, still kind of, like, somewhat good, mostly hapless motherfuckers, and then, like, what they were trying to accomplish was the real problem. Yeah. Like, it, it's, it's doing a, a that, clearly, at least to some degree. Complete with them even being purple. True. Purple. But, uh... Yeah, we'll see how it goes. Uh, okay. Yep. In any case, uh, wait, uh, it's uh, Spyro 3 on Sunday. Yep, Spyro 3 on Sunday. Spyro I better get that set on up. Sunday. Uh, till next time. And I've been buoyed right at the last second. Hell yeah. Maybe... Oh, we're coming in clutch. Eh. Yeah. Good night. Good night. Good night, everybody. Well.